Guys did it again. <laughs> Hype train to start the stream. Amazing. How do you do it? Every single time. Wow. And I just realized I forgot to put my chat on my prompter. Usually I have you guys up there where I can read you as I stare into your eyes and then the camera. And I it's down there now and I got to fix that real quick. Sorry. Uh, <laughs> professional streamer. You think I'd have this down by now? Hold on. I can do this. I know exactly what I'm doing. Um, yep. Just bring a little window over there on the prompter and bang. Done. Why is it weird? It's being weird. Okay. I don't know why it's being weird. Okay. It's good enough. Your chest, it, it's its smaller today. I, I That's okay. I, I'll get closer. I'll get even closer to read what you say. It's all fine. It's fine. This is fine. It's we, not weird. Uh, Don't miss it. Didn't miss the stream. Good. Good. I'm glad you can make it. Oh, jeez. <laughs> No neck kisses today? Oh, okay, okay. All right. We won't let things get too weird. <laughs> uh, the Gig Squad should do VR Phasmophobia. Yes, we would love to. We would love to. If if it works, we got to test it out and make sure it's going to be it's going to be good. Um, people have been amazing. Hero Swan, thanks so much for the uh, the 3 months of Prime and the message. Just wanted to let you know how inspiring you and Skiz are. Thanks for all the hard work, dedication and wisdom. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate that. Thanks for the continued support. Randy and Akel in the house with a thousand bits. Thank you. Choo -choo. Bits for the hype train. Thank you, Randy. You're amazing. Mad Rose 23 with 100 bits. Sub to Mumble being amazing with a five gift sub. Bomb. All four gigs have had the headset now. Five. All five of us, actually. All five of us were in the uh, the video, right? Uh, if you count Gem, Scar, you know, the, the three Gs. We could have double the, the triple G gigs. Too bad they, uh, we gotta get a five person lobby in Phasmo. We need a, I need to talk to the developers. They need to make it happen just for us. <laughs> Chris from the Abyss, thanks for the 100 bits. Thank you, thank you. you. Guys are amazing. We got a lot of work to do. Yeah, just gotta make sure Scar's strapped in nice and tight so he doesn't fall out of his chair. That was, uh, whoo. Phasmo could, could be worse. Potentially. Phasmo could potentially be worse. Crazy. Crazy. I don't think they let their uh they you have mods for Phasma. You get banned or something. I don't think I've heard that there's like no mods for Phasma. Or the, or there if there is, you can get banned or something. I don't know. Anyway, uh we got a lot to do today. I'd like to be productive and record. Uh I want to double dip. If that's okay with you. So we're gonna have some YouTube clips. Hopefully not too much YouTube voice today. <laughs> I've been dialing it back a little bit, right? Hopefully, hopefully I'm more myself than the YouTuber impulse. Uh, but you'll still hear something. Because, you know, I need to get a little animated for the video. Otherwise, people think I'm falling asleep. <laughs> we double dip. We get a stream content and video content for the tubes of you. That's what we call Tango's YouTuber voice is worse. <laughs> Tango, Tango, he just, yeah, he, he, yeah, I mean, we all do it. Well, not all of us. Etho does not have a YouTuber voice. <laughs> it's just Etho. Gotta love that about him. Gotta love that about him. But yeah, I think almost everybody has it. Like, I noticed Jem has it a little bit. Uh, Joel definitely has it. Uh, Green's is, yeah, Green has it a little bit. Not, not super dupe. Skiz has it, I noticed in his video. I just watched Skiz's video that came out. Nothing wrong with it. Nothing wrong with it. It's just noticeably different, and it can be jolting when you're watching a stream. And I go from this to, you know, What's going on, everyone? My name is Impulse, and welcome back to Hermitcraft. You know, you get all that animated uh, up and down voicey, and it's faster, and yeah. Just more energetic. It, it can be a little jarring if you're settling in, and, you know, these streams are usually chill. And all of a sudden, I kick into high gear. Coffee kicks in. It's a customer service voice, exactly. It's nothing wrong with it. I gotta fix. I gotta fix this. I can barely. <laughs> you, you're. Uh... What I see in chat today is so small. I don't know why. Yeah, I'll deal with it. Never mind. I because I don't know how to fix it without it being weird for you guys. So we'll deal with it. <laughs> I just gotta squint. Actually, my eyesight's pretty good. Hopefully, it's not starting to give. 
Should I fix it? Okay, I will fix it, but the stream's gonna get weird, okay? Let me try to fix this. Okay, you're gonna see like yourselves for a while. Until I get it figured out. So I will be right back. Strange. I can't fix it. <laughs> Look, mom, I'm on TV. <laughs> uh, I, I, it didn't fix it for some reason. Oh well, I don't know what's going on. I guess I'll have to buy a new computer. And it solves that. <laughs> oh, I'm famous. <laughs> I see my name. <laughs> Gongan, thank you so much, Gongan Two, for the thousand bits. Tiny Toby, thank you so much for the hundred bits. Uh, hey Impulse, I have some Phasmo Dev Insight. They have no plans to make five player. They have no plans to make five player lobbies, and yes, you can and will get banned for mods and Phasmo. Hope you've been doing well. <laughs> Alright, Tiny Toby, thank you so much. Um, yeah, I mean, I, I get it. You know, the maps are made to be a certain amount of players, and it's just. I have four other friends that want to play together. <laughs> it's hard. I mean, it's it's worked out. We usually like sub in, you know. There's usually one of us that can't make it. It's just there are a few times where all five of us want to play and it gets weird. Like, which one of us is going to sit out? You know, it's a bummer. Uh, time for Logan says, I've had issues messing with text size, moving windows on one monitor to another. Hard to drag it back and forth to the main. Yeah, when the monitors are like different resolutions, which I all, I'll, I'll like four of my monitors all have different resolutions pretty much. Um, as I drag stuff in between them, it gets a little gets a little wonky. But that's the first time that the uh, the chat has done that to me. It's weird. Deco Demon, thank you so much for the hundred bits. Okay, so we got work to do. I'd I'd love to make some very good progress on my video today. Um, things are things are a little bit crazy right now. Getting prepared for the uh, the charity event that's happening on Saturday. Um, been getting together some auction items for that. Uh, if you guys don't know, bang. We're doing a big charity stream this weekend. Oh, yeah. Uh, a lot of hermits will be streaming. And uh, so you'll be bouncing around channels depending on who's streaming and when. Uh, we'll get that full schedule out to you guys soon so that you can see who do, who's streaming at what, what hours and whatnot um, and kind of like the things that we're doing. But we'll probably be going most of the day. Um, just just as we're starting to build up content for this stream, it's looking like we have a pretty full day. Like, regardless if you can't make it at 8 a.m. Pacific, and you might be able to tune in five, six hours later and still find us, <laughs> the way things are looking. Uh, so it's, it's gonna be a nice long one. It's gonna be good. It's gonna be fun. Um, yeah, lots of different hermits will be streaming and stuff, so I wouldn't say everyone, not everyone streaming, um, but yeah, a lot, of, a lot of different hermits will be streaming and, and doing different things. Um, it's gonna be great. It's gonna be great. We're hoping to, uh, get a, get a whole bunch of money. <laughs> we're hoping to get a whole bunch of money from you guys. Uh, the charity, for the charity, of course. Uh, we're hoping to get as many gamer, uh, uh, the carts, the go-karts funded to send out to hospitals worldwide. For, uh, for the kids, uh, and the kids and the parents, I found out when I visited a hospital nearby that had a, a gamer cart. So yeah, that's that's happening uh, this Saturday. I will say... Change to yellow? Worked? Okay. I will say that um, I'll probably end up moving my Friday stream to Saturday. Just because there's so much to do. I'm going to need that time. Okay, so yeah, uh, fair warning now. Don't uh, <laughs> don't change your life schedule to make my stream on Friday because it's it's not gonna happen. <laughs> I'm just gonna say it. it's not gonna happen. Uh, I got too much to do. So, but see, you'll, you'll see me on Saturday, and 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 probably for a, a good amount of time on Saturday. We'll make up for it for sure. Um, Friday night stream will be off as well because we got to be up bright and early. 
This thing starts at 8 a.m. Pacific. <laughs> I can't stay up. <laughs> I'll be a wreck. I'll be a wreck. <laughs> So, no, we'll be getting up early to do the stream, so no Friday night stream either. So, yeah, no streams on Friday. Um, but I promise you, I promise you, I promise you, we will make up for it on Saturday. I'll be around. How did the wife's chat too turn out? It turned out great. I didn't get any pictures. I didn't get any pictures. And, uh, and I know what it says now. It says gently rage. It's a... It's a term used by one of her idols, Tommy Rives. You guys probably never heard of him. Um, he's like a, a a fitness trainer, athlete, marathon runner, guy. Just in, super inspiring life. Um, anyway, um, she's infatuated. I feel like I should be worried. <laughs> and he he has this term of like rage on, and then turned it into gently rage. It's like attack life, but in a in a in a mindful, peaceful manner type thing. I think is like. The way she described it to me, I trust her. <laughs> it looks great. It looks great. And it's like on her, yeah, just just below her like watch line right here, kind of the bottom of her arm. And it's like in his handwriting. It's really cool. It's really cool. I supported it for sure. Uh, I'll, I'll try to get a picture of it once it heals up because right now it's, you know, fresh. <laughs> uh, Nims. Nims? I, I'm not sure how to say your name. Nim. I'll just call you Nim. Uh, with the one in the middle. Uh, 100 bits, high impulse. My birthday is on Friday. Can I get a birthday? You, yo. Yeah, Nims. Nims. I, can't, I don't want to say your name. I wish I did because it's your birthday. I don't want to say happy birthday. Uh, but yeah, birthday, you, yo, for you. I'm on the wrong button. Birthday, you, yo. Why Hope you have a good one. Nim, for short. We, that's what we're going with. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you for the 100 bits and have, we have a good one. Back Cat Eva, thanks for the 100 bits. Me again, couldn't sleep last night. All my thoughts about the bunker were running wild. Are you me? Did I just donate to myself? <laughs> Fat cat, I was up at 3 a.m. So, and I'm pretty sure I haven't, I didn't fall back asleep. Not sure if you finalized the idea yet or not. Um, if you have, ignore this. I was thinking maybe a big open cave, kind of cave area, all grow, grown, overgrown and all, with living, farming, etc. Uh, all sorts of domes, kind of like greenhouse. Ooh, like um, the biosphere. That's good. I like that. So inside the bunker, it's like a biosphere. Inside bunker make like biosphere i write these things down and then i let it marinate um so we'll see i like it though i like it that brings some life inside and if people are like literally living in there that makes sense craxus craxus i'm so good with names thanks for the 25 dollars can you dig it got a dnr that's so good to hear thank you Thank you so much for your message. Wow. Thank you. Appreciate that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we get the the the, the plants and stuff to provide oxygen. Uh, we create, oh, like a water reclaim, reclamation thing. Oh, there's, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, stop making me lose sleep. <laughs> oh, man. It's like... It's so weird because I'm just so excited and having so much fun that my brain doesn't want to stop. It doesn't allow me to stop thinking about all this stuff. <laughs> so, <laughs> no you, <laughs> no you. <laughs> That's so good to hear. Thank you for your message. Um, so yeah, it's all right. It's all right, I'll sleep someday. Tango! He's logged in and out like a few times since I've been on, so. <laughs> Tango! Okay, guys. Time to, uh... <laughs> what is he doing? What is he... What is he doing? Why is he back there? Oh, no. Tell me he didn't come for XP. He came for XP, didn't he? He's gonna do it. 
Green, get your own XP. Dang it, man. Oh, there goes my bit. Uh, dang it, Grid! Uh, <laughs> Did he pull from this one or that one? Okay. Well, it's going to become part of the bit now. <laughs> he was muted too. He was deafened. He couldn't. He wouldn't have heard me if I undeafened. Um, yeah, the thing above his head. Okay, well, uh, this is fine. This is fine. So, um, yeah, I, uh, I finished, I finished hooking up all the redstone for the bump and go, and, uh, I AFK'd overnight to store up the XP so that we can find out how much this has. Uh, the light's on, which means it should be full of at least 30 levels. But as you just saw, Green just came by and probably, probably took the XP, but we're going to find out. Let's see. We stand on the plate. We take one of these things out of the furnace. And did he take the XP? He took Green! <laughs> we were testing! Oh, and he doesn't, he didn't get the training. So he doesn't know that he's supposed to hit that when he's done. See, he, he. You can't, you gotta, you gotta let people know. You gotta trade them up as soon as you make something or lock it up. <laughs> looks like, looks like we're gonna have to, to do another test. Hopefully the light will turn on again before the end of this episode and we can get a real test going. That literally had no XP left. Anyway, it is missing a core feature of it that I talked to Skizzle Man about. And that is this. When you hit that button, after you pull your XP, we need to hear this. Ooh, way to go. Good job. Oh, yeah. Right? Are you going to bop it up? I can bop if you want to. Let's go. You can bop if you want to. Bop and go. Our friends behind. But if our friends so, come. we're going to install that right now. Okay, I'm going to see if I can do the timestamp thing. I don't know which button to press. I have a little thing that's supposed to save timestamps. Whatever, I'll find it. <laughs> I know you're reviving. I know you're reviving, but we gotta we gotta keep going. We'll listen to Bot plenty this this stream. Don't worry, guys. Green <laughs> came in. I AFK. I AFK'd last night till the server kicked me out to make sure that thing was filled with XP so that I could get a clip to prove that it worked. And he comes here and yanks the XP before I could record the clip. Oh, man. <laughs> I tell you, I do. That's fine, though, because I, it's, it's actually funny because there's multiple times in the video that I've been recording that I mentioned that Green has been asking daily if this thing was ready to go. So <laughs> it's pretty funny, actually. It's pretty funny. All right. Um, let's see here. So this block gets powered when you hit the button. Which means we can just do this. Uh, hoping this fits. Yeah, it should. It should. So tight. This is a tight squeeze. Like this redstone has been so hard to work with. Just because of how tight of a squeeze it is. Uh, let me go get another block. <laughs> now he probably got a good amount I want to ask him let's see how much he got real curious because I did get kicked out of the server I can't AFK overnight because the server restarts at like midnight my time 36 all right, he tested for us. He got 36 levels. It is working. That's perfect. Awesome. That's good to hear. That's really cool. Okay. What did I just do? That's not what I meant. 
That's so cool. Every time somebody comes in, there's going to be like 30 plus levels. That's a whole idea. You guys probably... I've kind of like skipped some content for you here. Um, for some reason, I just kind of assumed you guys were tuned into Skiz's stream yesterday where I showed this off. I'm sure some of you were not, right? Okay, if we put the bop disc in this dropper, when you, yeah, when you hit the note block out there to say you've pulled the XP, it should activate the dropper up into the hopper, into the jukebox, and play. Okay, that fit in perfectly. A couple of you guys were here, or were in Skiz's stream yesterday. Perfect, perfect. Ooh, okay, okay. We do have... Uh, yep, okay, I can fit in here. I think this will work. Oh, man, I'm collecting cactus. Did I bring enough stuff? Oh. It's not easy. Tight squeeze, tight squeeze. Okay. And then this will be hopper into that. This should, I hope this works. Where's my other jukebox? Oh. I left it behind, didn't I? <laughs> Tight squeeze. A couple of you made it. Yeah. To Skiz's stream. That's good to see. There was more than a couple. There was just, just more than a couple. I had this one ready to go. Can't afford you boxes. Too many diamonds. Expensive. Uh, we do have a couple other issues we got to solve here. As you can see, this thing's constantly going and there's too much. There's actually too much dried kelp, which is crazy. I mean, that's a good, it's a good problem to have, I suppose. Okay. <laughs> good stuff. Okay. Let's go test. There is something else I need to, to test anyway. <laughs> Too much dried kelp. <laughs> that's awesome. That's so awesome. Gotta love it. Yeah, so we'll have to uh, balance out what's getting sent to this. Right now, there's too much kelp and not enough cactus. So we need to do some, we need to turn some dials down in the, in the machine room. Red Legion, thank you so much for the 510 bits. Gotta go, sadly. Uh, have a good stream. I'll catch the VOD. All right. Hopefully, I'll have it up tomorrow. Okay. Okay, so now we should have our jukebox installed. Uh, we're just going to go ahead and I'm not even going to try to pull XP. I'm just going to go ahead and tap this and that would simulate getting the XP and then turning the system back off. Yes! <laughs> now, I made the range on this thing very, very short. So you're literally only going to hear it as you're standing here. If you guys want to hear the whole thing, you're going to have to hit the link in the description. Ellie Beatmaker. Check out the Ellie Beatmaker mix on YouTube. Full song. But if we back up just a little bit, there, gone. So it won't bug <laughs> Joel <laughs> uh, or, or really anybody. I think even if I'm in my storage room, I won't hear the song. Let's see how close we have to get in order to hear it. That song goes on for two minutes, so we have some time to test it. Okay, as I'm in here. Oh! <laughs> we have to be this close. <laughs> we won't even know half the time that, that somebody's out there playing the song. That's amazing. Okay, that's perfect. I think that's a pretty good range. I think that worked. You can mop if you want to. behind. Doing our own remix now. <laughs> oh man. Uh why not bop during XP? You mean like if you just go stand on this pressure plate? <laughs> so you stand here and then it starts playing. That's not a bad idea. I'll have to check something. Let's see if that's even possible. And we're done. Okay, there was the end of the song. Uh, you stand here. 
Hey, no, we could make that work. Okay. You know what? One of the advantages of live streaming is sometimes people say smart things with their faces. Well, I guess with their fingers in this case because it's typed out chat. Uh, had a great suggestion to make it so that it actually goes off as they're waiting at the pressure plate instead of as they turn it off. Oh, it's going to play again. Ooh, way to go. Good job. Yeah, I'm going to do that. We're switching it up. Hey, no taco from me today. We're doing it. We're doing it. That was a great idea. Sorry, I missed the name of who said that, but uh, that's that was a great idea. I like that. It's not like that system's hard, right? <laughs> so we just go uh, bop. I can't get this out. Okay, there we go. I don't want to lose it. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh no. I didn't want to lose the disc. Where do you think the disc went? Uh, disc. I need you back. Did it? Did it go? Oh no. Did it go up into the water? Oh shoot. <laughs> uh, did it fall down there? Hello? Disc? Uh, hello? Wait. Nope. Uh oh. Why is there? Okay. We lost it. We lost the disc. That's bad. <laughs> Let's turn on hitbox to see if we can find it. Uh, I feel like it might have. It might have gone into. Oh, gosh, it's so tight in there. It's so frustrating. Uh, did it maybe go into this place? I broke the cart. I broke the cart. I can't get in there. Oh man, I was really hoping it maybe fell into. There it is! Found it! Crisis averted. We're good. It did. It flowed through the system. Wow. We're lucky it didn't keep going into fiery death right there. Oh, that would have been bad. That could have gotten bad. I mean, not that bad. I just have to make another one, but still, I didn't want to. I didn't want to have to make another one, so I'm glad we found it. This time, I'm going to pull the disc out first. Okay. Excellent, excellent. Ooh. Alrighty. This should hopefully be just as easy. Let's find out. We just got to look for the bamboo. Ooh. It is pretty tight, though. It is pretty tight. Oh, no. We call that a lesson learned. Yeah, exactly. Um... Uh-huh. Okay, watch out, Cart. Now... They would stand... On this one? I think? Nope. See, I was wrong. This one right here. Okay. So, they'll activate that block right there. Power is that block. If I power the dispenser... I could put a block here with redstone on it, and that wouldn't hurt anything. And then I can power the system right here under their feet. Because um, I do, it, it wants, you need to shoot it up, right, into the hopper. Yeah, you got to shoot it up into the hopper and over, and that way it cycles. There might be a different way to do it, but that's the way I know how to do it. So I think we can make this work. I think it'll be easy. Just need a bit of redstone, which I don't have on me for some reason. You could just do one player triggered by the pressure plate. Uh, yeah. Yeah, because if you do one and then the other, that's kind of, like, weird, right? We can wire them both up. That would be easy enough. I'm so confused to where I am right now. <laughs> Being sleep deprived is uh, never fun. Okay, uh, so, yeah, we'll grab a couple of extra redstone then and see if we can we can do that. Anything else I'm gonna need? Let's see if we can manage. Uh, 
I do show off how this system works. Oops, in the video. It's kind of wild. <laughs> it's kind of wild how the redstone works in here. Took me a while to figure out, but I got it. I got it. Um, ooh, difficult here. Uh, that might be more difficult than I thought to wire it up. We might have to keep them separately. Because what I was hoping to do was just power this and then put it here, which also is going to be difficult. Well, maybe not. We can move this. <laughs> Why is that still powered? What is powering you? Oh. Okay. I don't even need those. Nice. Free levers. We got a birthday in the house. Whose birthday is it? Shadow Rider, happy birthday. Birthday. Here you Hope you have a good one, Shadow Rider. Mm. This will be nice too, because it's even it's like higher up even. Break this real quick. Oh, no. What did I just break? Oh, the rail. Oh, be careful. Oh, my gosh. I forgot that scaffolding there. Oh, man. That could have been bad. That could have been real bad. Eh. I got this backwards. I meant to do a dropper there. Mm -mm. Eh. Come back up. Eh. Okay. I need to not be on scaffolding for a second. That'd be great. Okay. That should work. Let's go test it real quick. Put that back. Shouldn't have affected anything. Yeah, when you're on the pressure plate, it you, we're locking these hoppers on purpose, so that's not a problem. I think we're good. I think that'll that'll work. <laughs> I I'm so afraid to spill water down there, because that redstone is woo, pretty rough. <laughs> pretty rough. Oh my gosh, Trissy, thank you so much for the hundred bids. Love having you entertain me while I'm at work. Well, I hope you have a good day at work. Okay, here we go. All right, so now we've wired this up to the pressure plate. So as they come up to collect the XP. Nothing happens. Perfect. Um, dropper, why you no fire? You're definitely getting powered. Oh, because that hopper is locked. Okay, no problem. No problem. Oops. No problemo. <laughs> okay, okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. We unlocked it after we left. Yeah. <laughs> that, oh man. You guys are going to get so sick of this song today. So we just go. I didn't think of that. Okay. I'm afraid to touch this. Okay. You can do it. You can bump up, up, up. Oh no. Wait. My guy. You can bump if you want to. Oh, so I'm not playing any other stream music because we're just going to keep hearing that. <laughs> What's up, Sam? You walked into a pole today at work, and then two minutes later, you walked into a door. <laughs> oh man, you got to watch where you're going. Jeez, that's rough. Green <laughs> says, Sup. <laughs> Tango. Just be a nosy. Great. Sup. Alright, that should fix that. If you want to. But we gotta wait for the song to end. But if your friends don't pop, and if they don't pop, then there's no reason. You can kinda wanna make sure it works before we. But if your friends don't pop, and if they don't pop, then there's no reason. Alright. I love it we can fade out. So it's not too loud. 
Smile Kitten, thanks so much for the 300 bits. This is the first stream I've ever been able to catch, but my birthday was on the 21st, and I would love a birthday yo yo. Oh, well. 21st. Okay. Extended birthday week. Happy birthday to you. I hope it was a good one. Hope you had a good one, Smile Kitten. Glad you could make it. First name, Rogers. Thanks for the 100 bits. Any ideas for the name of the city? How about Circuit City? Oh my gosh, Circuit City. No, because Circuit City went bankrupt. <laughs> I liked Circuit City, actually. Um, that place is great. But no, that's good. That's good, Circuit City. Um, I've got a few ideas. Uh, yeah, I, based off of some things I saw in the comments, I'm, I'm kind of wanting to go with a little bit of alliteration. I, I definitely, because I'm an egotistical person, I got to have my name be part of it. So Pulse might be involved. So I'm kind of dancing around something that involves Pulse. Also, I, I want to uh, make a reference to the, the fact that we're down uh, from a mountain. There is a, there is a, I, I'm not even going to go look. Somewhere there's a wandering trader and I'm not even gonna go find him because I, I have zero emeralds and I don't want to get I don't want to get um, But yeah, I'm thinking uh, this is kind of a valley right down from the mountain kind of in a valley I know uh, it'd be great if there's another mountain over there to really make it a valley, but Anyway, I, I'm kind of like I'm kind of dancing around something like that Got some got some things brewing got some things brewing Okay, I think by fixing that redstone dot now we shouldn't be locking this hopper and We're still locking the hopper. Which, what, what is locking here? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Should that not have powered this block to fire this up and this, oh, we're locking this hopper because we're standing, wait a minute. I'm confused. This dust should not be locking this hopper. The pressure plate's above here. No, it's here. Yeah. That's not locking this hopper. What is happening right now? It shouldn't be... There's no quasi... Did it not... I wish I could look in here. This shouldn't be locking the hopper because it's not... It's not directional, right? I I, I toggled the mode, so it's not pointing that way or that way. The pressure plate, there's no quasi locking, right? F3 and see if it's, if it's locked. Um, triggered, true. So it triggered it. I wanna know if Enabled true. Can you dig it? What's happening? Can you dig it? Not locked. It's almost like the disc didn't spit up. Right? It's like this is fully powered. What in the world? I could, I, I, if this is an issue, I wonder if it's, I want to take the hopper out and just like put some items in there and see if they, they come flying out when I step on it. Yeah, I want to know where the disc is right now. My guess is the disc is in this hopper. It's hard to tell. I, I like, I need another person here. Um, you can't throw, wait, can you throw items on, on this? Can I throw an item on this? Will that work? This will keep it down, right? Yes. Okay. <laughs> what a weird way to test. Oh. Puka in the house. What's up? <laughs> Thank you for the gift sub, Puka. Okay. Over here. Parkour. What did I hit my head on? Nothing. Oh, the scaffolding above me. Okay, this... Oh, that's... Why was that stopped? It's still in here. This didn't fire. 
So that doesn't fire. If I could move the whole thing up, that would be great. Can't. Ooh. So when it powers it, because it stays powered, it didn't fire? Oh, or maybe... Hmm. So confused. I'm so confused. It shouldn't need two discs. Unless you're saying that it was stuck in this hopper back here. But nothing would be powering this. So it should have flowed through. And then when it received that update there... That should have just powered that. Hmm. Hmm. That's very confusing. Uh, what's another option here for us? That's so strange. Uh, nothing else in the system would be powering it. There's nothing, nothing else in the system here. I took the levers off of this guy. Maybe it's some weird thing because now nah, the rail shouldn't have anything to do with that. Hmm. I could move it lower. And then it would quasi. Right? Can I move it lower? Where could I move it to, actually? I can't. I'd, I'd have to move it there. And we're talking. Now we're getting water spillage. Although the water is not going to cause any damage if it comes out. Uh, I could move it one down, but I'm not sure that's going to help because then that. Then that's going to get locked when you step on this. Very strange. What if I change that to a slab? Let's try changing that block to a slab. I'm taking this. <laughs> I'm going to change that block to a slab and see. I got a feeling it's something to do with that block. That might, might fix it. Redstone is fun. It's like we had the easiest system set up and then we and then we went to make one little change and it's like, oh how is how is that not working right? Okay, let's see. Give me this, give me that. I mean this technically shouldn't unless we leave it like that, but Alright. Let's try it. It's being weird. It's being weird. Yeah, this shouldn't work. I don't expect it to work. Oh, it would help if I put the disc in it. <laughs> How will we know if it works? There's no disc in there. Oh, this cart, though. Come on, get past it. I don't want to fall. Why is that cart stopping? Oh, these rails are off now. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Were those just off? Uh-oh. Weren't these just off? What what would you say you do here? There's some weird things going on. The detector rail shouldn't have Oh, I see, I see, I see. I see, I see. There's a detector rail here, so the power that this is getting from this... The power this rail's even getting is actually from the detector rail. Okay, so we do actually need... Alright, alright, alright. Now I see. Oh, that's gonna break that. Okay. <laughs> it's too tight in here. <laughs> oh man, it is way too tight in here. I hate it. It's okay. We'll make it work. We'll make it work. <laughs> oh, we'll power back here. It's fine. Everything's fine. Okay. There we go. Now we don't have to worry about those rails. We had broken the system. If for some reason this works, I'm I'm going to be scratching my head. The only way I can think that it, if if this turns on and this pops the disc up, it's the quasi connect to the quasi powered, right? Because it's coming down at an angle. But usually you need a block update in order for that to happen. Anyway, we'll find out. I, I doubt it's going to work, but hey, that's what we're here for. Uh, the hopper's locked. 
Oh no! This was supposed to be easy! Yeah, that hopper is locked now. Permanently. Get out. Get out of here. Hate you. Let me come over here. We turn it. We turn it out. No problem. No problemo. We turn it out. That sounds like some sort of like cool dance or something. Can he... Okay. Keep that there. Give me that. Okay. Lever on glass between the rails. Uh, I got to power both sides though. You were thinking like here. It's all right. We turn it out. Sounds cooler when we say that. Okay. Now, nothing's locking that, right? We good? I still don't understand why this makes zero sense. Why having a block here that gets powered wouldn't just, especially like that. Wouldn't just power the dispenser and, and have it shoot up. That should totally work. Why wouldn't that work? I don't understand. I don't understand. That's what we tried before and it didn't work. That's why I highly doubt this will work. And then, oh, why they're standing on it. It locks these. That's not that big of a deal. Standing... Here. We'll also lock. No, no, it's above it. Never mind. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Mm -mm -mm. A target block? To redirect the redstone line? Where's the out? I'm gonna open, I'm gonna keep this door open since we're going in and out so much. I did put the disc in, didn't I? I don't have a disc on me. I'm hoping it's in there. Okay, that makes sense. That shouldn't work. I have the disc for the other system. I have two discs. There's two systems. Right? Right? We tore apart the uh, both systems. So I should have two discs. See? Okay. Let me try this again. Full block. Oh. No, that should still be... Oh, because this is weakly powered. Because it's weak. Does that mean? Okay, we'll try it. <laughs> it's not weak, no, because yeah, you're powering it directly from the block above. So yeah, no, the dot, the dot itself is strongly powered. The block is weakly powered. Ooh, way to go! How is that any different than the first thing we did? Right, are you gonna bop it up? Up if you want it. You can up if you want to. You behind. But if your friends don't bop enough, I don't, don't understand how that was any different than the first thing we did. <sighs> okay, time to wire up the other side. Is it because of the levers? The levers I removed. Okay, I kind of want to. You can bop, bop, bop. What happens if I eject this disc? Okay, we gotta go get it. <laughs> I I thought that might happen. <laughs> because redstone is fun. No, redstone is fun. Just not when you're streaming at 9 a.m. <laughs> After not getting a full night's sleep. <laughs> is this not fun? Oh, it's always fun. Yeah. No, we figured it out at least. I still don't quite... Something was obviously different in the way something was getting powered there. Uh, let's put that back. Okay, so we'll just do the same thing over on this side. 
and we will we will be absolutely fine. Um, we've learned. We've learned our lesson. We know exactly what we're doing. Oops. Oh, I gotta go. Right, we gotta go. Ah! Don't go down there! I was waiting for water to flood in. That would have been terrible. Okay. I'm assuming that's where that is. Yeah. Okay. See, this is this is one of those moments where like having the free cam is almost necessary. Okay. Same setup. Should work. Carts, you guys good? You good? Ooh, that one's full. Oh, green pulled from that one too. <laughs> it's alright. Okay, back in place. All right, we should be good. Except it has no disc. Thank you. Kind of important. Kind of, kind of part of the system. Sort of important. Wait. Right, that one. Okay. Okay, we're done. It's perfect. It's absolutely perfect. Flawless redstone with impulse today. You're welcome. <laughs> You're welcome. For all that. Uh. Riptide Roar. Thank you for the $3.14. Pulse Doppler District. Oh, Doppler, like radar. Gotcha. <laughs> that's good. That's good. First name Roger. Thanks for the 100 bits. Oh, you had the cyber, the, the, the Circuit City uh, comment. It came through twice, by the way. Not sure why. Thank you, though. Unless you meant it to. Miss Gypsy Danger. Thanks for the $3.14. Name suggestion for the city. Double Pulse Valley. Double Pulse. That's cool. I like that. Trigger both and we experience ear blades. Yeah, that's probably going to happen. Should we do that? <laughs> Say, I'm thinking for the 100 bits. Oh, my goodness. Aw. This is not me. Not me making myself and my friend cry just because of a short I made yesterday on YouTube. Found an audio clip. Uh, you look so pretty, pretty like the sun, and putting uh, the finished ISV base creative build to it. I'm crying mess right now. That sounds awesome. That sounds awesome. If you're on Twitter, uh, tweet me uh, tweet me a link. I'd love to check it out. Or or just uh, whisper me here on, on Twitch. I don't think the Discord thing works. Um, okay, here we go. You ready? All right. All right, this should definitely work this time. Worked out all the redstone bugs. Uh, here we go. I hate everything. <clears throat> Move it. What else do you guys want to do today? Forget this. I'm over it. <laughs> what in the world? I don't want to walk off and off again. That defeats the point. The point is you walk up to it and it works. <sighs> okay. Okay, hold on. I don't know why I didn't just do this a long time ago. <laughs> Where is it? Where's the disc? Oops. Where's the disc right now? Locked in. It can't be locked in that. It shouldn't be locked in that hopper. If it did fire up and it's sitting in that hopper. Okay, we'll go take a look. It shouldn't be. Because we made that redstone dust round. Not pointed. Not directional. But we'll go find out. This is crazy. And it just worked a second ago. We just tested. What changed? What changed? No, it didn't fire. It's not. It's still in there. Why? <laughs> All right. Let's do. Let's do this. It goes through, so it's not getting locked in there. Nothing's getting locked in there. Yeah, they they once it once the song's over, it falls through. It falls through the jukebox. 
and it'll come all the way through to the dropper because this isn't going to be powered all the time. So confused. <laughs> I'm so confused. This hopper is not locked. Enabled true, right? Enabled false. See? See the difference? When this is like this, it's locking it. When it's like this, items should be able to flow through. For instance, that gets fired up and it goes through. So what is happening? Exactly. <laughs> oh man. It doesn't make any sense. This block should be powered right now, yeah? I can prove it. Move. Move. See how see how the powered rails are still on right now, even though there's no lever? That means this block is powering these, right? So it's definitely powered. It's like it powers the dispenser and locks it at the exact same time, right? So it's like powered and locked. So it's like it shoots, but then it get, but it stops itself because it's powered. Okay, okay, okay. We could have an observer pulse it. That would probably solve it. I just am baffled right now at why this isn't working. Give me that. Where's that disco? Oh no. It's gone. It gone. Where'd it go? There it is. We could do. <laughs> this is so dumb. I don't understand things. Okay. We fix. We fix it. Once and for all. No more goofing around. No more redstone shenanigans. We got to be done with this. We got other stuff to do. Dispenser, not a dropper. No, it doesn't matter. Dropper will put it into the hopper. It's absolutely fine. A dropper will, will put it into the hopper. That has nothing to do with it. Uh, I keep thinking I can make that jump, but I can't. All right, here's what we do. Here's what we do. This is fine. This is fine. It's fine. I, this is exactly how I wanted to do it. Uh, we'll just take this and we will face it down into a block. It'll get a single pulse and it will be fine. Um, I feel like I don't even need to test this. I should probably go test it. Because nothing's gone right today. So, right. I keep going too far. Okay. The disc was in there. Do I keep putting the disc in there like so fast you guys don't see it? Okay. That doesn't matter, right? That it's different because you don't you can't tell when it's in the ground. Ooh, way to go. Okay. Good job. All right, are you gonna bop it up? I can bop if you want it. You can bop if you want to. Okay. First try. Uh, I hate it when things don't make sense. So we just go. Bop. Okay. We do have to go get that, but this is fine. Okay. And then bop that. Bop that. Observer. I, I do like observers. Observers are nice. They they are very helpful. Especially with tight redstone lines and stuff. Like there's a I did a lot of observers. See this? See this? My my observer stone that's happening here. There's a lot of observers to make this system work. So I guess they just they, we just felt like we needed some more observers, is all. Alright, this one does not have a disc. And the other one, I ejected above. Oh great. So we better go get it. That's a note block. 
Yeah, I meant for that to be a note block. Um, boop, 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 boop. The note block gets powered. The observer sees the note block changing states, and that's how it sets it off. Can I? Uh oh, I think that was a bad idea. Okay, we'll put it in there. Ugh. Mm -mm -mm. Bang. Fix this. Okay, we're good now, yeah? Okay. T test number 89. Off we go. <laughs> okay, it didn't work last time, but it's definitely going to work this time. Here we go. I have no clue what's happening. I'm getting trolled. Tango, are you? Is Tango here invisible? Ooh, way to go. Good job. <laughs> what in the world is happening? I'm looking for name tags. I feel like I'm being trolled here. How? So we just go, bop. shut up. <laughs> okay, sure. I don't understand. I don't, I don't understand. Um, <laughs> this makes zero sense. Somebody, somebody tell me why it's going on. How is this going wrong? How is this going wrong? That's single ticking this, right? That's that's single giving one little one little tick of pulse to this block, which should activate that. There's no other power unless I'm missing something. There's nothing else getting powered around here that would stop this from getting put into the jukebox. This hopper should not be powered in the slightest. There's no other power. This is at this is at a at a corner. Right? So this block being powered should not have any impact on that. That's not the way redstone works. These lines aren't doing anything either. It's just so weird. It's just so weird. There's no way it's diagonal powered. That's that's impossible. The redstone doesn't work that way. <laughs> this is not quasi connectivity. If this block was powered, that's quasi. That would be different. But that's not what's happening. Um, this isn't getting powered. It's getting a pulse through from the note block. Guys, there's five minutes. There's five minutes. It's not going to despawn. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Making you guys nervous. The pressure plate would power this note block. That's it. Okay, hold on. Hold on. I built this one the exact same way. Let's see if this one has the same problem. Ooh, way to go. Good job. All right, are you going to bop it up? I can bop if you want to. Let's go. You can bop if you want to. If you leave our friends behind. But if your friends don't bop, and if they don't bop, then there are no friends of mine. Bye. You can bop if you want to. You can leave our friends behind. But if your friends don't bop, and if they don't bop, then there are no friends of mine. So we just go bop, 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 You can bop, 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 You can bop, 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 Wait. My guy. You can bop if you want to. You can leave our friends behind. But if your friends don't bop, and if they don't bop, then there are no friends of mine. You can bop if you want to. You can leave our friends behind. I'm but so getting trolled bop, today. And if they don't bop, then there are no friends of mine. So we just go bop, 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 b
It's where your camera is. This is the weirdest stream I've ever had. This is the weirdest stream. I actually like that rendition. That was great. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm having a day. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> and we're done. Okay. Okay. Check. Checking on things here. We're going to check on things. Okay. Uh, might as well go down there. I'm, I'm going to put slabs there. I'm going to put slabs there. Just in case there's something to do with these blocks being full blocks and powering. Um, we need mosaic slabs, which I can make, yeah. Oh, this place is a mess. Okay. Ooh, just, just, yeah, just... Don't change anything and try it again and see if something, <laughs> something changes. Right. I will not have a clue. Okay. I'm going to go, I'm going to go down and check on it. Let's go check on it. All right. Well, it didn't work that time, but next time it's going to work for sure. <laughs> this definitely needs one of those skizzle bed <laughs> bits, doesn't it? <laughs> so insane. So insane. Oh, I love when things don't make sense. Um, can I get back there? Wait, didn't something drop? Okay. That was me being mad, right? That's why there was no disc? <laughs> don't tell me this entire time it was because there was no disc. <laughs> okay. That's why we checked. Yes, gently rage. Gently rage. That's what we're going to do now. Um, okay. Double check in the system. They are wired up the exact same way. Facing out. Disc. Perfect. Disc. Perfect. Shouldn't matter what slot of the dropper it's in. Let's, you know, just because things are wild, let's make sure they're in the same. Okay. All right, well, it didn't work that time, but this time it's definitely gonna work for sure. <laughs> Here we go. Here we go. This is definitely it. There's no way anything could go wrong. Here we go. This is the one that's not been working. We're gonna test it first. There we go. Ooh, there go. All right, and we're gonna do the remix. All right, are you gonna bop it up? I can bop if you want it. You can bop if you wait want a minute, wait a minute. Okay, okay, that's cursed. We gotta back away. We gotta back away. Um Okay, we fixed the one on the left. And now the one on the right is not working. <laughs> uh Ow. Okay, we gotta go eject these like now. It's it's this is so cursed. This is so cursed. Stop it! Stop it! Okay. <laughs> okay, you know what I'm gonna do? Cause I've been I've been wasting so much stream time going back and for forth. Uh oh. Where'd the other disc go? We lost it. About time we fix that. Um, uh oh. Uh oh. It gone. This gone. Hello? Uh oh. <laughs> where, guys, where did it go? Where did it? Oh, okay. Oh my gosh. Okay, we gotta get it. Get in there. Oh! 
There we go. <laughs> oh, man. Having a very bad day. Nah, it's fine, but I, I'm just, it's, this is so confusing. It's so confusing. Okay. Disc. Disc. Dropper. Dropper. Nothing is different. Everything over here is exactly like everything over here. It's exactly the same. Just mirrored. Uh, Would you pull it together? B-dubs? Yeah. This is stupid. Come on. <laughs> Come on. Figure this thing out for goodness sakes. <laughs> this is so dumb. All right. B Wait, with maybe... our two brains combined, we can get this. Okay, right, okay, we'll okay. This. Perfect redstone would be dubs time. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Go ahead. Pick one, anyone. Right. Stay there. Nothing. Nothing. But you, when you get off, it's going to do it. There it goes. <laughs> Reverse powered. Good job. Okay. The other one's working perfectly. Yeah, go ahead. Step on the, the one on the right. And it yep. starts right away. Yep. Good job. Yep. Unless the other one's going. Are you going to bop it up? I can bop if you want it. <laughs> you can bop if you want to. <laughs> yeah, hold on. Let me... did, did that just go up there? It, I got it. I got okay, it. Sweet, I got it. I, I, I really, I, actually, I'm here if, uh, for disc grabbing. So you can just test <laughs> This was this a two man job. Discs. Yeah, thank yeah. you. This definitely was yeah. a two man job. I've been struggling on my own for okay. sure. Uh, I got the records for you if you need. Great. Okay. Let's see. This one should. This is insane. This yeah. is insane. Whatever's happening here. Doesn't make any sense. It doesn't make any sense. They are the exact same setup. We're not on, I just checked, nothing crazy like chunk borders or anything no. like that. There's no, no crazy weird. Well, okay. I lied. This is actually on a chunk border, but that's the working one. <laughs> yeah. And that shouldn't matter. You wouldn't think so. No. You wouldn't, you wouldn't think so. What else could we be missing here? These are literally the exact same system, just built mirrored. Okay. Could could that pressure plate is on top of a note block? Yeah. And that note block is triggering this observer when it gets powered. Yep. Which yep. which fires into this block right here. Powers it. So it gets a one tick. You know, power pulse from that, which should yeah. fire this dropper. Oh. I'm gonna, I'm gonna watch this dropper. Why don't you go stand on the pressure plate and let's I'll see go if this stand disc on moves. The pressure, pressure plate. Yeah, the Man, pressure. It'd plate. be nice if there was an overlay that would, that would like show you powered blocks. Would yes. that be nice? That would be cool. Um. Okay. Are you ready for me to stand on? Yes. Okay. Yep. There it goes. What changed? Perfect. What changed? <laughs> you were looking at it. That's what changed. What changed? I don't. <laughs> <laughs> it freaked out because you 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 looked at it. Did you get the record? Uh, no. <laughs> I right clicked it. Okay, oh, it shot out I'll somewhere. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. One at a time. Get it. I'll get One at a time. You. Well, it's somewhere. Mm -hmm. This is. <laughs> It's the, pretty insane. It's not. This is so weird, man. It's this so is weird. weird. Yeah. Okay, did you find the the? Dis oh yeah, it's it nope. likes to pop itself into this little comparator mess over here. Hold on. Oh. I can, okay. uh, I can climb up and snatch it from below. Okay. <laughs> Dude. So we changed nothing, and that time it worked. Wait, yeah. Oh, there's. Okay. We'll just keep doing it. <laughs> you could hire Skiz to <laughs> sit under here and sing. That would be, that would be a much better idea. Yeah. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Okay, I'm looking at it now. And it didn't work. It didn't work. Hmm. Maybe it's like, you know at Disneyland how you have to be certain tall to get on the ride? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm not saying that's a thing. Well, but, I mean, in this case, it would be a weight issue, right? <laughs> okay, yeah, okay, yeah. It's a pressure plate. That, okay, that's true. I deserve that. <laughs> <laughs> B-dubs, are you calling me fat? No, 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 never, never. Are you calling me short? Never. 
No, never. Okay, okay. We're 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 both in the clear. I don't know where that went, man. That's gone. It's I gone. Got... Oh, the did record? You... Yeah. I think did... I just put it back in. Wait. Did you get it? Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> yeah, I put it back in. I put okay, it back so in. it's in. Okay, your turn. Your turn. Go ahead. Okay. <laughs> okay, here we go. I can't believe it. Dude, it up? I can Dude I've walls. never been so confused from Redstone in my life. This makes zero sense. Zero sense. Oh. Oh, there it goes. Okay, zero. Go. Zero. Okay, and hold on. It's it's it seems to work every other time. Okay, but let's test this theory of it works for you, not for me. You're okay, gonna go going. you're gonna go now. Go. Didn't Aha! Work. Aha. Every other time it works. You How might is be that right possible? about this every other time thing. Um, is there just one music disc in here? Yeah. Should we pop in we another one? Uh oh, where'd that go? Yeah. Did it go what up there? We did too. Yeah, I got it. Here it comes. Okay. Pop it in there. I'm gonna steal this one from here because this one, this one seems to work every time. Okay. Oops. Okay. Um. So let's steal this one. I mean, because we got, other... you got more of those discs that you could. Release. I can make more. I have to do the commandy thingy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah okay, yeah. two discs in there. Two now let's see. In. Last time, now it, this should work. It worked last time, right? Right. Okay, go. But we want to get two in a row. Or no, it didn't work last. Oh, time. it didn't work. It so worked this when I Should off. work. Okay. Yeah. Go ahead. There it goes. It worked. It worked. Ooh. Okay, and pop it out. Okay. You got okay. that? Oh. Oh, it Ooh. popped when I walked off. Okay. Okay. Other disc up there or somewhere else? Yeah, coming down. Okay. <laughs> There's both of this them. This is wild, man. Okay, so it worked that time first time. Mm-hmm. Okay. But then, so, then it sounds like it triggered again when I walked off. It did off. trigger All again right. when you walked off. Okay. All right. Should I go? Yeah. Okay. Got it? Okay, I'm staying on. Tell me when to walk off. All right. Are you going to bop it up? I can bop if you want. Yeah, go Let's ahead. Go, you can bop if go you ahead, walk off. off yeah, so what's got, what that's going to do is when this disc ends, it's the other one's going to start. So you really can't have two in the system. Otherwise, you, you get like a, a pretty bad loop going on. Right, 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 right. Okay, right, I got right. one other I got one other thing. I'm, I might think, I might have solved this in my brain. Maybe okay. it's the way the audio player works. So... Maybe it knows the song is two minutes long, and it won't work again until two that minutes. two minutes is up. And that's mm. what's been happening. It's been working every other time. Yeah. Because we tried to activate it too soon. So right now, right. it's too soon. It's still thinking it's playing the song from before, because it's a two-minute yeah, long song. Thinking. Yeah. But the other one, it's been a while since we tested it. Right. Test it. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. That one's definitely yeah. gonna work, right? Okay. Yes. Yes. Okay. Now watch. I eject it. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Did you got it? Did it go up there? Yep. Okay. Oh, Pops I don't have it. No. Okay. No problem. It. I find it. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Did the comparative thing. No problem. I get it. I get it. I think this oh, might be. I think spot. this might be it because I don't think we tested the other one like twice. Right. We're still within the two minute period. Right yeah. Now. This is so tight squeezed out here, man. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. Quickly, quickly. Watch. Go ahead, step on it. It's not going to work. That's Didn't it. work. That's it. Solved it. Didn't work. Good news. Wait a minute. It just started. It pops on the off. <laughs> Are you going to bop it up? I can bop it up. Well, that works too. Whatever. As people roll out. <laughs> Yeah, 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 a little goodbye yeah. song. I, I think this so, is, but that's, that still doesn't make sense why it just worked there, then. Why it works when you're off. Yeah, is yeah. that like a T flip-flop problem? Is it T flip-flop? Oh, there's nothing T flip-flopping about it. But I mean, it is changing states. The note block's changing states when you get on and off, so both send a pulse. So that yeah. part makes sense that it does on and off. But usually that's not yeah. going to matter because the disc is still playing. Right. And so nothing's really going to happen, you know? Yikes. 
I'm going to say it has something to do with the custom audio player and thinking it still needs to play a song. That makes the most sense to me because redstone wise, this is perfect flawless redstone. It is perfect B -dubs, flawless B -dubs approved redstone. Flawless redstone. Yeah, I approve of this. This looks really good. <laughs> There's hoppers and observers and note yep. blocks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's how you know you're getting crazy. Note blocks. That's and when you know it's and, good. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Now, yeah, well. if enjoying jukebox budding issues, yeah. See, I remember last season Scar had an issue that Tango put like a comparator on something with records for Scar's Scarland music. Um. So there's budding issues. <laughs> Get over here. <laughs> That's it. We're calling in Tango. He's been there, done that, had this issue. Yeah. It's yeah. obviously some Minecraft bug that he's that he discovered. And I mean, it's definitely not a redstone. <laughs> it's not not your problem. There's nothing wrong with the redstone. It works half the time. Right. <laughs> <laughs> right, right, right. <laughs> the definition of working. Yes. <laughs> Weird. He said he said the jukebox is being budded powered. Um there's nothing bud powering the jukebox. Bud powering would mean it was up at an angle to either two blocks above it or at an angle. Mm -hmm. A block up and over. Mm -hmm. That's 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 the bud that's the quasi connectivity, right? That he's talking about. Mm -hmm. There's nothing, nothing powering this from up and over. The closest thing is is this note block right here, but mm -hmm. even that's at a diagonal from it, so that's not a thing. Mm -hmm. mm. He's not coming, no. is he? No. Tango not coming. No. <laughs> he don't want to uh. come over. <laughs> Explain what he dealt with with decked out. I want to know. This is so weird. Has it been two minutes? I'm like, the fact that it works every other time just doesn't make sense, right? It doesn't make sense. No. Like, because if it was a bud power thing, it'd be you'd find some consistency. The oh, consistency wait a minute. you're finding is inconsistency. The power in the dropper can't quasi, can't bud power the jukebox. It doesn't travel up ever. It's usually the other way around. The jukebox getting powered would cause a problem with the dropper, but that's not happening. Right. I want to build this up up here. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah, so you could see it. Yeah. Um. If you're in F3, does it show powered or not? Does the state change uh, for certain things? Yeah, a few F3 things like a hopper will show false for enabled. Uh, Could, I think same with the dropper, right? Can we we'll do have that? Triggered with true that versus be? ooh, triggered true. Right now, this dropper is saying triggered is true, which means it's like powered already. Put it's it's. Yeah, oh! That what? This one's triggered false. Okay, okay let's, Tango, are, explain are that. The records in? Let's test them both. Let's see which one works. Right? So the triggered true shouldn't work. And the jukebox is powering it because it believes it still has the record in it? I just stepped on the pressure plate. Does it say triggered false now? Um, yes. On the okay, dropper. I'm gonna walk off. It'll say triggered true. Yep. Okay. Well, no. Triggered hey, false. Oh, triggered, triggered false. false. Well, I'm off that. now. I'm off. Come up if you want it. You can. I go up. Tango, yep. come over. Hi. Hi. Is it? Is it keeping that? I don't. I don't know what you're. I mean, I haven't seen. Let me. Let me see what's got going on. It's here. a standard All I know is if cycle. You, if you do. The, if you do the standard two by two yep. loop. Yep. It doesn't work. You get the 50-50 play. What the heck is that? Because the, the jukebox powers when there's a disc in it, right? Yes. And that is up and above to the left of the dropper down below. Mm-hmm. 
So that you, that you're getting some kind of weird. I never understood it, but but I when you eject the standard. disc, right? The right. jukebox should no longer be given off power. Right. But the dropper never gets an update, so it keeps thinking Correct. it's quasi powered. It it's powered. So the uh -huh. next time you power it, okay. it's like, and I'm good. The dropper needs to get an update. You can't do the two by yeah. two with just two hoppers and a little tiny square. Okay. I've, I swear I've used that in the past and didn't have issues. You probably have. And you probably tested and it was like, yep, good. And then you didn't realize it was only working half the time. Strange. Okay. So what did you do? What did you... <laughs> this, this, they this they made the it so this was supposed to work like this. <laughs> they made it so... Here's, here's what would work. <sighs> is if you just update the dropper. Right. You know what I mean? Like, it, that's the only reason it's having a problem is because the dropper is not getting an update and it's just holding on to that triggered is true uh, state. I forget how to do it, but, like, this is what you're doing right now, right? Oh, you're down there in the guts. Yeah, let, let me make a jukebox. You got one. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, perfect. Okay. I mean, that's not a jukebox. It's a note block, but let's just pretend. We can make a jukebox real quick. Be worth it. I can it. go get this one. Want me to go get... No, just steal it. Sucked into the well, system. I it could. don't remember how I No, it's did fine. This. You I used a comparator, Tango. I mean, th there's, the, it, there's the simple, like, you can go three by three, but, you know, then you're getting really big, right? You can go, like... Uh, da, 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 Just da, to da, get da, it away da, from some, it? Some, yeah, like, you make a whole loop, and I started doing that in the places where I had space. Um, but let's I'm let's do a demonstration up here just so that we fully understand what's yeah, happening. Yeah, sure, sure. Yeah, because there's a real jukebox. Uh, there we go. Dropper underneath. Oops. Okay. Disc goes in. Okay. Uh, we just need to do a, give a little power to this guy. Doesn't matter how, really. Yeah, you go a button on the. Yeah. Here. This is what I was doing. Observer. No block. Perfect. Right. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Right now, dropper showing triggered false. The worst part is I gotta listen to this stupid song all the time. <laughs> we can put in a different disc. <laughs> okay. Triggered false still, which yeah. means uh, B dubs. We want to throw the. Oh, never mind. I got it. Okay. Worked again. Okay. It's working every time. <laughs> I, I, I've had the same inconsistencies, and then it just randomly stopped. Maybe it's a directional thing. It's a directional thing. I don't know. Oh, like right now, what we're doing oh, no, is you not can't do that. You can't do that simple two by two loop. That's crazy. Should I do it? Does anybody have things to make a pressure plate I can stand on up here to exactly simulate it? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, it's a different pulse, do? right? What would that do? It's it's coming from above is all. So, like, uh -oh. right now, what I'm doing is we got a note block, observer down, and then basically pressure plate on top of here. Uh, I'll actually use one of these in case it matters. Shouldn't. Uh, uh, uh. And oh. you can throw it to me. Okay. Eh. Okay. Right. All right. And then that's not a thing. Okay. So what's in here now? Weird stuff. Okay. Ready? Works. Ooh, way to go. Good job. We take it out. Put it in. Oh. Where are you putting it in? Each by time? me putting this in the dropper, is that that's updating the dropper? I bet to not be triggered anymore no trigger true still true no. okay so now it's not gonna work right yeah <laughs> this is silly because yeah because the dropper was bug powered by the observer yeah. but it didn't get an update yep and now triggered false so it would work Go ahead, B Dubs. You need you need scaffolding to get up there no no, big, no 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 you're a big I'm fan good. I'm good I'm good <laughs> I'm He's smaller. Big. I'm small. I'm like a Are quarter you? of the size. Yeah. <laughs> oh, did that? Way to go. <laughs> okay. Okay, hold on. All right. Check it again. Still triggered false. It would work again. <laughs> it's hard to get the disc out. All right. 
Triggered false. It's it's random. It's not even happening every time. I, I, that's what I found too, yeah. What in the world? This is a stupid bug. That's it. I'm calling them Just, Yeah, don't don't bang your head against this. Just try and find a workaround, find a different design. It's gonna be a little bit bigger. <sighs> you can go two by three probably. Dang it. Like you could probably go like this. You know, something like that, maybe. Yeah. Obviously, that'd be gone, but. Yeah, yeah. Just gotta power it from. <laughs> That's so silly, man. That's so silly. Hmm. There's gotta be another was, way too, just to. I was to... doing something with like a piston that extended that. Updated yeah, just the, to update it. Yep, yep, yeah. yep. That's what I was thinking. A rail, you know, a powered rail yep. next to it. Just they got power. The they would light it up, and that would change it to triggered false. Okay. All right. I'll just, I'll find a way to make it the, the two by three instead. Is it makes sense. Is this a vanilla it, it, or is this it, a data pack? No, is it's, it's a, a vanilla pack? thing. It's, it's, yeah, it's the, no. the fact that the jukebox, because they did change that, right? They made it so yeah. that when a disc is in it, uh, jukeboxes actually output a signal now. So you could tell, like, you could read the jukebox and tell which disc was in it. Right. And because that power is happening and it's at a diagonal from the dropper, it's, it's quasi powering the dropper. Yeah. And then bud powering, right? So until you give it a, an update, a block update next to it, it's going to stay that way. It's going to stay triggered. That makes sense. No, it makes sense. No. I forgot that the jukebox actually puts out power that way. Yeah. Yeah, it makes sense. All right. I'll, I'll figure Enjoy. it out. Enjoy. It sounds like you got plenty of space down there. Work, so <laughs> Dude. Good thing. So good luck with that. <laughs> this wasn't oh, supposed no. to be banging my head. <laughs> Classic case of bud powered T flip flop quasi connectivity called from the start. <laughs> oh. Hey, B Dumps. Well, yeah. I was going to let this happen organically. Mm hmm. Can we take a walk? Yeah, let's take a walk. All right. You recording? Because you might want to be. I might want to be. Okay. I don't know All if right. this is your day off or what, but. This is just a relaxing. It, it might be worth time. hitting record button because I don't know how you're going to react to this. Okay. Okay. I don't know how I'm going to react to it either. Yeah. Yeah, okay, I was going to let up. this happen Slack. naturally. Um, but then again, you might not have been recording. I just okay. want to show you. I, I I know you kind of have like your builds and I kind of have my builds. And I was hoping it was okay with you if I crossed that line just a little bit. Um, yeah. Add a little bit of detail to some of the things that you've been doing. Okay. I just want to see if you'll actually notice, though. I, I kept right. it pretty minimal. I will so, notice. Okay, yeah, I know, I know. You're, you, you, you notice every <laughs> pixel, every pixel. You notice when I put the, the, the frog lights backwards. Yes, yes. <laughs> Even though they're covered with pressure plates. Okay. Yes. Any, anything stand out? Anything new to you? Um, let's see. <clears throat> Signs are still crooked. Those nope. aren't fixed yet. No. Nope. Nope. Um. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. <laughs> I don't have the money, dude. I don't have the money. Well, I have it. I have it. Don't worry. Don't worry. I'm not gonna hold you. Uh, I'm not gonna hold you accountable for what you said there. But, I told. Uh, I told Impulse <laughs> on Discord I would give him ten thousand dollars cash if he figured out how to put grass on non. How did you do it? <laughs> how did you do it? If I figured out how to put grass on stone, he was going to give me $10,000 real money, is what he said. Oh, this is armor stands. Oh, gee. Oh, jeez. Okay. Okay. Oh, it's perfect. It's perfect. It's perfect. I didn't think about that. I didn't think. If I knew, if I if I thought about armor stands, I would have said maybe like $50. <laughs> okay. I went a little bit further than that. You may notice that, that some of these... Uh, <laughs> Some of these look a little different than normal grass. Like, see how this one's darker? Yeah, yeah. Check, take a look. Watch. Look at that. Oh, man. It's, what? Wait. It's, oh, it's a custom model. It's a custom model. Oh. Yeah. It's a custom model, and I hid the item frame. Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> uh, let me but test you something could, here real you quick. You could do armor stands and position them anywhere you want. Um but yeah, look over here. Look at this little guy. Look at this little guy. Hold on. Let me check. Let me check. Let me check. <laughs> oh, I'm wearing it on my head. Wait, what do I look like? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a pumpkin. Let's see. 
Oh, I don't see I'm it at all. I'm wearing it. Oh, you don't oh, see it? No, I don't see it at all. Oh, okay. okay. Oh, no, it's coming out your... <clears throat> Hold on. Never mind. Hold on. It's coming out my butt! <laughs> <laughs> Why is your grass out of my butt? <laughs> oh, jeez. I love the little guy. That's great. That's so good. <laughs> That's so good. There's a... Let me, let me grab this. Okay. There's oh, eight total variations it. to uh, to play with. Look over here. A couple different shades. Oh, wow. So we got yeah, yeah, yeah. I like this shade. This shade I like. You know what? Yeah. I think yeah, yeah. Just a variation is nice. That's yeah, cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We don't want to go crazy with it, obviously, entities and item frames and stuff. But uh, <laughs> dude, I was I put these down yesterday, and I've just been waiting for that message on Discord. I've been waiting. Checks in the mail. <laughs> <laughs> like, like, I know I said this, but, uh. <laughs> oh, I'm going to be careful of my challenges to you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Goodness sakes. Anyway, oh, so cool. have fun putting grass on concrete in stone and in streets and stuff now. It looks we great. Look like, it's coming out. Like, weed's coming out of the cracks. I was, little, I was going for a drive yesterday, and I yeah. noticed, you know, the median's in the middle of the road, and they, they have a lot of stone work and stuff. And there's yep. weeds coming up out of the stone. And I'm like, sure look, enough. why can't yeah. we have that in Minecraft? Oh, it makes it's sense. so good. Yeah. In, these, in these, like, non-trafficked areas, especially, like, kind of next to the wheel here. I, I should have put that next to the wheel. But, you know what I mean? People were, aren't it's stomping perfect. on them, you know? Yeah. They're not stomping yeah, the weeds yeah, out. Yeah. So, yeah, they would totally grow through the cracks and bricks and they stuff. They absolutely it happens, would. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> this takes us to another level. I mean, because with this now, we can maybe put like a little bit of grass and moss and mm -hmm. leaves in certain spaces just to help decorate it. Dude, that's such a great, <laughs> a great I'll send you the, uh, the the model numbers and yeah, it's carved pumpkins. I mean, it's I could have so just good. done a, a regular piece of grass, I suppose, but I wanted to get fancy with it. So, Absolutely. Plus, you know, I couldn't stop thinking about the 10 Gs you promised me. <laughs> 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 oh man, you can retire if I keep challenging yeah. you. Yeah, Mozabop, the guy that made the custom model, when he found out, he said, I, I definitely undercharged you for those. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Oh, that's amazing. <laughs> yeah, oh. another thing to add lag to the city, like we needed more stuff, right? But we definitely, yeah. <laughs> if, if you walk in here and you're not getting 24 frames a second, because we want cinematic, you know, we're doing right. it on purpose. Yeah. We want that 24 frames a second cinematic feel, so when you're walking <laughs> through, it feels like mm -hmm. a movie. Exactly. Plus, yeah. I promised I promised that this would be a game, and basically the game is to not have your computer crash. And that's how <laughs> yeah. you're literally yeah, that's, walking that's the framey. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was great. <laughs> that's the game. If you can make it through the city without your computer crashing... And catching you fire, you win. Yeah. That we <laughs> Nobody's ever thought of that. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? Brilliant. I love it. We're geniuses. <laughs> oh man. Okay. Well, Redstone, I do apparently. But I, <laughs> I I do have a I do have uh it's not ten thousand dollars, but it is uh, oh, a stack of this, uh, this is almost better. Stack of I can make I, I can to... make four trap doors with this. Thank you. Hey, you can make a couple <laughs> trap doors there, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, yeah, that's it. I'm gonna a make couple... a. I'm gonna have a custom model for copper trap doors, and we'll just use. Jack oh, letters. we just need a pumpkin farm. We'll build the whole city. Yeah, exactly. Jeez. <laughs> uh, I'm surprised you had copper left over, man. Like, uh, what, I went and I a... got two. I got two copper veins yesterday. Oh wow. Yeah. Okay. So I'm aging a bunch in my house too. To nice. Get ready. Okay. But, uh, yeah. Okay. There's a, a free stack for you. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, we'll definitely use it. I didn't do a, I didn't do an upper walkway um, because there was nowhere to go. <laughs> yep, nowhere to go yet. Yep, yep. I mean, you've been yep. slacking lately, B Dub. So if you could just really maybe slacking. pop a building up about right here, so I could do an upper walkway, that'd be great. <laughs> I know it's been like three days without a build going up in here. I'm Jones and like I'm, I'm over here shaking, sweating a little bit, <laughs> like. <laughs> Yeah, if uh, it's not done by the end of the month, we're gonna be have the full shakes. Yep, <laughs> yeah. totally. Mm. Uh, I love the way this turned out. Everything's looking looking beautiful. pretty good. I, I notice I'm missing a couple trapdoors here and there. I need to do that, but 
Um, yeah, and we'll get those in. Uh, everybody, everybody's been been just gushing about this fan, and I and I can't. I can't take any credit for this one. This one you you put in when we were together and created. I did toss that fan in there. Yeah, yep. I've made several in my life, so it's not. You it's know. beautiful. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. People did yeah. say maybe have like here or there aged a little bit more on these grates. I'm not sure. Yeah. Uh, it turns it a little too green. Yeah. It might work in spots. I don't know. Yeah. I I I, I obviously that's a thing. I, I kind of prefer when you pick a copper stage, you stick with it. And just stick it, yeah. In an area. Yeah. If there was like 10 stages and it was just slightly yeah. different, then maybe. Yeah. Yeah. I'm with you on that. Let, let, let's try it, though. Let's let's be open-minded. We can at least go this way a little oh, bit yeah. and see what happens. Yeah. There goes my wax. Okay. <laughs> There's your wax. Gone, gone. It's okay. I stole it from Tango anyway. It's fine. It does... <laughs> It does me messy it up a little bit, too much. I think. Oh, he stole you the lose disc. the, you lose the visual of the uh, fan behind, and it, it attracts yeah. more to the to the grates in the front. Right, right, right. Yeah, yeah. You want to pull the eye to those those blades because they are really yeah. well done. Yeah. So yeah, I agree. Yes. All right. Well, uh, we'll the, I'll come back and they'll be per perfectly green. And then I'll we'll fix them, them and wax in. them. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I don't uh, think I have any. Do I have any wax? Um, oh, also no. wanted to say, if you want to take another stab at how I connected the power lines up, um, I'm not sure I quite nailed that. No, I thought that was great. I, th I think that's great. Yeah. I mean, okay. I, the machine up there is very cool looking. I love that machine to uh or it's like a you know transformers yeah well like that. i think one thing that was said was like instead of having individual chains come out having one thick oh uh, yeah absolutely. conduit instead yeah. that because might be if better this is, yeah if this is a generator powering all these lines it should be something real hefty yeah it needs uh, to go to like a transformer and then the transformer splits off you know? Yeah, 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 yeah. So it's not exactly, like, realistic. But that's, you know, who cares? It's, you know. <laughs> In the cyberpunk yeah. world, anything is possible. Anything <laughs> is possible. That's that's exactly right, uh, yeah. I but, mean, really, you, if you move these out one or two blocks and then just put some fluff behind oh, it. Oh, yeah. Just pulling all the way out to the pole and then put the transformers yeah. on the pole. Like, you have, you have these little... Uh, I guess they're called transformers, like where you have the furnace Who and the knows? block underneath. Yeah, that's kind yeah, of yeah, yeah. like I don't know. I don't know this stuff. I, I don't work in that industry, but we need to get degrees. In that's that. it. Yeah. Uh, well, you yeah. saw last episode. I don't know if you saw my episode, but I met up with Sir Durple and, and AD Craft, and we'll yes. just do that with electrical engineers, <laughs> so that we can nail the the power grid here dude how amazing would it be if next episode you cut and it's real life and you're on top of a power line with a, with a with a, another person and they're explaining no don't yeah. touch that wire yeah. don't touch that with the with the like belt thing around the pole and i'm hanging off the power pole yeah 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 that'd be fantastic <laughs> that'd be fantastic yeah we're, that's the way we're talking we're really taking it up a level you know yeah yeah go all the way full immersion <laughs> Oh man, yeah. And then maybe IRL, I could cut off my arm and and get a prosthetic arm. Oh, that'd be amazing. You know, really live the cyberpunk style. Yeah. Oh, people had some great names for for what snips could be. I was curious. Comments. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I saw nips. Was somebody said? Wait, no, oh, not that nip tuck. Like, uh, yeah, because you mentioned well, the dismembering body parts. You know. Yes. Yes. Is a little spins. Gory. Spins. That's what it was. They said uh, snips backwards is spins. Yes. I saw that one. Right? That was good. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. What do you got? Uh, there was oh, there was a few good ones. That some of them. There was a really good acronym for snips that worked with cybernetic kind of like end there, and I think a Y instead of an I to make it more. You know, cyberpunky. Yeah, 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 um, yeah, yeah. I'll have yeah. to dig through and pull pull some out. But I, I just remember a com like scrolling through the comments yesterday, being like, "Ooh, that's good. That's good. I should make note of that." Yeah. And then I didn't. So, if you could say snips with a C and a C Y, y. yeah, yeah, and a Z at the end, I like that. That feels 
cyberpunk right there. Yeah. You throw a Z on the end cool. of anything, it's cyberpunk. Because <laughs> you could say the language changed, you know? I mean, yeah. it's already changing. Like, we have new words like poggers and, and you know. <laughs> yeah. Uh, All the hip What stuff. do the kids say? Yeah. Um, yeah. They say lots of stuff. <laughs> Say something, say something hip in the chat, guys. Riz, yeah, Riz. that's new. That's, that's uh, new. Uh, Dabs. No cap, no cap on that. No cap. That's like fully yeah. invented by this generation. Mm -hmm. So yeah, based, based. I had to learn what that was. I every time somebody said based, I thought they misspelled biased. <laughs> I was oh. like, man, these kids don't know how to spell these days. They keep trying to say that, that that's a biased comment, and, and instead they spell it B-A-S-E-D, and I'm like, no, someone need to teach them how to spell. And then I found get out if, that, that means offended. something different. <laughs> yeah, not, it's actually a compliment. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. It's not too no. different from bias, but it's close. You know, it's close. We're trying, guys. <laughs> yeah, we We're are. really trying. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> uh, all, right. all right. So you gonna send that uh, wire or mail or how, how do you how do you want to send that that ten G's? Oh, uh, it'll be like a bank transfer from okay. um, like well. Uh, um, I, uh, <laughs> you're good. You're good. See you later. <laughs> Oh, man. I couldn't do it. I really wanted to wait and just see if he'd be just walking the streets and notice. And I get that DM from him. Dude, I can't believe you did it <laughs> with the grass. I couldn't. I couldn't wait. I thought it would be more fun anyway to, to have it, you know, us there as well. <laughs> muzzle pop, that was good, yeah? That was good getting alive. Good job on that muzzle pop. Those those uh those models for the grass was done by by muzzle pop, so thank you. Oh, do we really have to go back to doing this is this is nowhere near what I was supposed to do today. This this job was supposed to be the first 30 minutes of stream max. And uh that stupid jukebox quasi connectivity thing. Stupid. It's stupid. Um, well, we could put the jukebox here. I don't love it, but that's what we got to do. Fine. We got, we got enough space, I think. Oh, Tango gave me some extra hoppers. Thanks, Tango. Needed them. Now that I got to make this thing so big. <laughs> uh Okay, uh, the jukebox will get powered from that, but that shouldn't matter. And that's only every once, actually, no. What is that coming from? I can't remember what system this was coming from. That's okay. It, the it power in the jukebox isn't gonna make any difference, I don't think. So we put it there. Should have done this a long time ago, but I had no idea what was going on. Okay. <sighs> We're good. It is just a gigantic mess down here. Okay. So that should solve it then. Going to work 100% of the time. And we learned something today. Jukeboxes suck. <laughs> That's what we learned today. Uh, okay. That and done. All right. What problem will we run into now is the question. All right, so that fire is up. It's going to take a couple extra ticks to go over. Now, oops, I keep I keep doing that. And then it should play. There should be no... I'm going to stop saying these absolutes. It's going to work perfect first time. Guaranteed. Wait, I blew it. Oh, we'll pretend that didn't happen. Can you dig it? <laughs> Can you dig 
Wait a minute, wait a minute. What's Miss Adele? Oh, I lost my pressure plate. Is it mosaic? No, it's regular. Okay. Let's try this one. The hoppers are overlapping. With what? Oh, that's <laughs> so it goes, it goes up over and then back into itself. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So the the model that the model that Tango showed me obviously wasn't wasn't gonna work because it goes into itself. Flawless every time. Okay. So we got a skirt around the side then. We got a skirt. This is uh, it. Just keeps getting bigger. Just keeps getting bigger. Sweet. What a stupid system. <laughs> okay. Tango, when are we going to learn? When are we going to learn? Never, ever, 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 ever do redstone on stream. Ever. I'm, I actually, I don't think I have enough hoppers to make this work. Let's see. Oh, I have just enough. <laughs> okay. It's going to work for sure. I don't know what happened to the pressure plate on that one. Here we go. It takes a little bit of time, but at least it works. Okay. Are you going to bop it up? I can bop. Ooh, the light's on. You can bop if you want to. Got like two sources of music playing now. All right, let's kill that one. Okay. All right, we did it. That's kind of a bummer. There's, there's got to be a more elegant way to, to uh, update the dropper and make it so you don't have to do this crazy chain, but... Oh, well. Let me get another... Pressure plate. I gotta catch up on. Uh, I gotta catch up on all the awesome stuff you guys have been doing while we've been <laughs> solving redstone weirdness. Ah, oh, good. I'm glad to get that behind us, though. That was a that was a nightmare. That was a nightmare. See, Tango had his nightmare privately, <laughs> right? <laughs> He discovered that problem probably at, at one in the morning when no one was around to, to ridicule him for not knowing what was going on. <laughs> All right, should we test this one? It's going to work. I don't need to test it, do I? Yeah, it just takes a while. Okay. All right, we're good. That problem solved. First try. First try even. Seems like a good time to sit down and catch up with you guys. Actually, I'll, I'll just catch up and then sit down. Uh, <laughs> the pause scares you. Yeah, the light's on. Um, Green did pull the XP from that system, though, before the light was on, so it's not going to have full XP. Holy cow. Okay, when I said I missed stuff, I didn't realize... The gravity of that statement. So, geez, we've been missing stuff for over an hour. God, I just got caught up there. Sam, thank you. I did see that you got a whisper to me. I will check those out. Thank you for the 100 bits. Mad Maddie, thank you for the 100 bits. Remember that mobs will trigger the disc. Uh, hopefully there's no mobs. Oh, the pillagers, they come through. Yeah, there's nothing I can do about that. Um, that's okay. The mobs will come in and then they'll be bopping. The mobs will be walking through the city and bopping. It's supposed to be lively. <laughs> uh, thank you, Mad Maddie, for the 100 bits. KVG, thanks for the 100 bits as well. Fabled Noodle with the $4.20. Can you dig it? Hey, Impulse tweeted at you last week uh, after I watched the stream, but not sure if it was seen. But for Snips, I said the shop you and B-dubs were referring to in Cyberpunk is called Ripper Ducks. Yes, I had about... A hundred comments because I guess in uh, cyber, uh, what's it called? Uh, the cyberpunk 2077 or whatever. Um, 
that's what it's called, right? Like the cybernetics shop is called Ripper Docs. So instead, in homage to Snips, we'll call it Snipper Docs. Okay, that I like. Okay, people weren't commenting that. They were just commenting to call it Ripper Docs. And I was like, I don't want to call it the exact same thing that the game did. So that's good. Snipper Docs. That I write down. B-Dubs was asking. And I'm like, oh, I can't remember. <laughs> I can't remember what people said. I read all the comments. That's pretty good, Fable Dingle. Thank you so much. Blue Collar, thank you for the 100 bits. The only time it doesn't work is when you open the furnace. Is the furnace sending? The oh, pfft. yeah, we're going to have. Okay. Now we know. Now we've learned. Now we've all learned together through uh, my frustration. What's going on with those those jukeboxes? It's too bad that it happens like that. It would have been nice. <laughs> quasi. Quasi. Name the city after quasi connectivity since we love it so much. <laughs> Little Ricks, thank you for the $5 candy ticket. Get yourself a bit of soda after this redstone craziness yeah might need one truncate venus thank you so much for the five gifted sub bomb tayrim thanks for 100 bits would skulk sensors help um potentially skulk sensor you could use to update the dropper to to you know i was saying the dropper needed an update it could be a solution i might play around with stuff quantum redstone only works when observed <laughs> thank you revenant for the 100 bits monete thanks for the 300 bits Tango did have that problem during Dagged Out. Yep, you were absolutely right on that. Gongan, thanks for the 100 bits. Yep, and you're right about the jukebox power in the dropper. Just need to read your comments more often, huh? And then we had a Ken, you dig it, from Blue Rose, 84. Amazing. Uh, just, what? $300. Ken, you dig it. Blue Rose, 84. Thank you so much. Holy smokes. And then I made you wait 33 minutes before I acknowledged you. Thank you. Holy cow. <laughs> I didn't see that come in. We were still banging our heads against the wall. Ampulse, I've been watching your VODs on the second channel for years. Plug the channel. Yes. Yes. Second channel, guys. If you guys miss any of the streams or you can only stay for part of it or whatever, uh, I put all the VODs up on the second channel, usually within about 24 hours from the stream. Takes me some time to send it over and get a thumbnail made and stuff. Um, but yeah, should be there tomorrow. Thank you so much, Blue Rose. I'm glad you're uh, you're you're very supportive watching on the second channel as well. Helps me out a ton. I've always been able to brighten my day with lots of laughs. Keep up the great work. Oh man, I hope my frustration wasn't uh, <laughs> a different vibe today than you're used to. But yeah, we we got there in the end. Thank you so much. Amazing, amazing. Ken Faby, thank you for the hundred bits. A lot of subs, resubs. You guys are amazing. KVG, another hundred bits. Nocte Noctova. Noctva, three dollars and fourteen cents. It is your son's seventh birthday tomorrow. Oh wait, wait! Today's your son's seventh birthday, and tomorrow is yours. We get a joint birthday yo-yo for both you and your son. Birthday today and tomorrow. Amazing! Happy birthday! Enjoy it. Two days worth of birthdays. That's nice. Back to back. Zaber with a hundred bits. Thank you so much. Just play Bedrock. You don't have to deal with that stuff. Yeah. <laughs> right. Breadloaf, thank you for $4.20. Do you even need a jukebox for this? If you have the new audio player, uh, you can apply custom audio to mob heads for note blocks. Oh, my gosh. I forgot about that. Can you it? Uh, can you I forgot that was a thing. Hmm. Well, we got it fixed now, but that's a good idea. You can, uh, you can assign audio to mob heads, and then you just activate the note block. It's it's like the most simple thing ever. Tango, are you still watching the stream? Did we, is that implemented on the server? Hmm. I'll have to look into that, see if we actually put that on the server or not. Annie Pop, thank you for the 100 bits. Love how the city's coming together. Thank you. Epic, thanks for the 100 bits. Fabled Noodle, again, $4.20. Thank you so much. Says, uh, just started listening to the podcast while on a road trip. I'm on episode 12 and loving it so far. Starting a job where I'll be driving a lot on Monday and looking forward to listening and catching up. Amazing. Thank you for supporting the podcast. Yeah, 12. I think we're at 86 or something like that. Uh, so you got you a few. To, you'll, yeah, hope it's a long drive. You'll catch up. <laughs> Kia Cat with a thousand bits. Thank you guys. Cruising Psycho with a hundred bits and Sonic Hedgehog 
with 10 gifts a bomb. Cruz and Psycho said with the 300 bits, uh, you and all the hermits help keep me hooked on this game. I am absolutely hooked on this game right now. I'm absolutely hooked on this game right now. It's, uh, I mean, aside from the little, a little redstone issues we just had to deal with. I mean, I've been having the time of my life this season. Absolutely. Uh, it's top of the hour, so I'm going to sit down. Thank you guys for uh, getting through the struggles. We're going to get some work done now. Finally. Let me consult my list of all the things we were going to do today and cross about 10 of them off. <laughs> we'll push 10 of them to the the next stream because that's, that's about where we're at right now with our lives. Uh, I'm not sure how much of that I'm going to include <laughs> in the actual episode. It was supposed to be easy. Um, let's see. Okay. Yeah, we were supposed to uh, install the bop song. Test the machine. Obviously, with Green coming and grabbing the XP, that didn't. Uh, he tested it for us, so that's done. Perfect. Thirty levels plus, exactly worked perfect. Um, okay. All right, we're moving on to a completely different project. Rage Mountain, we'll call it Rage Mountain. Yeah. KVG, thanks again. Another, another hundred bits. Pendle, thanks for the raid. All right, guys. Um, we. I feel like I need to clean up a little bit. All right, here. Let's clean up. Let's clean up real quick. Uh, not the tunnel today. No, we're gonna we're gonna uh, we got something else we need to handle real quick. Ooh, put some of this in my redstone box. I should have done some already. Copper, so much copper. Feels good. You know, if they change the copper recipe, right? I've been thinking about this a lot. This is what I was thinking about at 3 a.m. when I couldn't sleep. Copper and iron have a lot in common, right? They're both like metals. <laughs> They're both metallic. Um, but to make a copper trap or an iron trap door, it's just four ingots, right? To make a copper trap door, it's six blocks to make two. Wait, how many did these make? One. Okay. Fair enough. Okay. But you can't make... You can't just do this because then you, you, you can't make it different colors. You can't make it oxidized in different states, right? So their solution was to use blocks. So that you can have different states of oxid oxidization for your, your trapdoors. That's fair enough. I understand that logic. But, why not go cut copper, use that, these can be oxidized, and just do four of those. You could, uh, yeah, I mean, you make them and let them oxidize on their own, but I see that, I see why. I see no reason why they couldn't just make this. The recipe. Therefore, one copper block would make one trapdoor. Mojang, if you're listening, I'd like to hear a rebuttal. <laughs> if they want to go six, I mean, fine. It would be nice if this did more trapdoors, but honestly, right now, I would settle for this. To go one copper block equals one trapdoor is so much better than six copper blocks equals two trapdoors. I'll take it. I'll take whatever win I can get, you know? Because that's ridiculous. I mean, maybe maybe go as far as this does too. This does two trapdoors. That'd be nice. That'd be that'd be real nice. I see no reason why they shouldn't do that. And I and I get why they went. I, I get why they went three and three. Right? Because isn't isn't that what wood does? Right? Yeah. So they copied the wood crafting recipe with the th with with the, th the three and three, instead of the two and two iron recipe. 
wouldn't this make more sense since it's a metal? Plus saves on some of it. Anyway, there's my diatribe. I'm done. I'm done. Mojang, fix it. Fix it, because this is ridiculous. Can't nobody afford your, your trap doors. It's too much. That's it. Hermitcraft gonna push. We're gonna push and push and push. We're gonna... Uh, what is that? Petition.org or something? <laughs> Should we get it going? <laughs> get it trending. Petition.org <laughs> to change... Because that's the, that's the most important thing in the world right now. <laughs> oh. <laughs> 10 million signatures to change the copper recipe in, or the trapdoor recipe in Minecraft. <laughs> Can you imagine? Oh, that'd be great. <laughs> We're making a difference, people. We're making a difference. Got my vote. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Ken Fabi, thanks for, again for the 100 bits. Retired Cowboy, thanks for the 400 bits. I've not been drinking a lot of water. Two by two makes cut copper. Yeah, but I'm saying use cut copper. Plus, you don't want to do it that way. Since we're on subject, you don't want to do it that way. Four blocks make four cut copper. The fact that they allow, they allow us to make this mistake is beyond me. Why would they? I because I made this mistake the other day and I was so mad at myself. Made me made me hate hate the game. Okay, I don't hate the game, but they let you. They let you waste copper. One gets you four. Here, four gets you four. I mean, I get it. The stone cutter is supposed to be some sort of an advantage, but I don't know. Don't even let people do that. I get. Uh, anyway. It's a scam. It's always a scam. Yeah. Okay, here's what we're going to do. So it's been a little while. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. We're going on a ride. That's it. We're going on a ride. I don't need to put my chest plate on. I'm brave. Come on, Tyler Swift. We're going for a ride. We're going to the shopping district. Time to see the server. B Dubsy's pressure plates are driving me nuts. I'm about to rip them out. <laughs> I notice when I'm recording videos and stuff, I'm constantly jumping over them just so that I don't have to hear the clicks while I'm talking. That's when you know. That's when you know you've made a, you've made some sort of mistake. <laughs> he hates them too. Okay, let's rip them out. Forget them. <laughs> Forget them. They're coming out. They're coming out. Let's cover them with carpet or expose the lights. I don't even care. I'll let you're working on a new design. Perfect. Okay. Okay. Man, am I gonna be trapped in here? It looks like Ren's got some sort of. He's got walls going up. Who who would who would wall off their neighbors? That's just rude. <laughs> yeah, we'll cover them with copper trapdoors. Perfect idea. <laughs> what the? Why? Hypno? I'm sorry. Oh, I'm so sorry, Hypno. Oh, no. Oh, man, I'm sorry. I didn't know you were doing a thing. Oh, man. I just got tripped out because I came over and saw a real shulker. That, that's my bad, dude. Yeah, no, Hypno no, no just problem. appears. I thought you logged in, and then I noticed there was no login message. <laughs> yeah, uh, just move one from the, from the end. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm just going to get into a uh, minecart and store it somewhere. Oh, okay. Okay, my bad. I didn't mean to... <laughs> that no was problem, a trip, no though. That was an absolute <laughs> trip. <laughs> <laughs> you you just I I like I thought it was a regular shulker box and then it opened and I was like why is there a random r like actual shulker out in the middle of a field and then hypno just bloop appears <laughs> Whoops 
Uh, messing with shulkers is not an easy task either, so I hope I didn't just completely make his life miserable. My bad. Nice timing. I am having a rough day, aren't I? Okay. All right, it has been a while since I've checked on our court stand here, and I'm kind of curious to see how many diamonds we have collected. Okay, so somebody did pay with diamond ore. That's absolutely fine, because we can fortune three it, and I got a feeling they probably overpaid anyway. So, oh. <laughs> okay, um, now i got to be careful. I want to keep track of how many diamonds we get today, because we're going to put it in our ledger, um, which we will maybe upgrade the trophy? Yeah, we might. We might. Oh, my gosh. Yes, yes, yes. We might make enough to actually get an upgraded trophy today. That's cool. Holy cow. Okay, these... <sighs> Quartz has definitely sold way better than I could have imagined. I had no idea that the Hermits would be this desperate for Quartz. And it's actually been pretty slow for me to get, even from the bartering system. So I'm thinking I might up my Quartz intake. Uh, we might have to do it. We might have to actually get Villagers and do a you know combination of bartering and Villager trading in order to keep up with the demand of Quartz here. Oh, and Ito! <laughs> Perfect. Ch that's all I see in chat when Etho logs in. I love that. That's all you can see in chat is the Etho. <laughs> yeah, you guys are funny. Oh, man. <laughs> okay. So, yeah, that's our next That's our next thing we're going to do. We're, gonna, we're actually going to get some villagers going. Little by little, I'm just... Uh, Stepping back from my promise to not do so much villager stuff this season, but here we are. I mean, honestly, I'm not doing like a full training haul, so I still feel like I'm holding somewhat true to that word. Ito! I should put that, that clip of me mocking his wall. <laughs> uh, Ren was stocking up on beacons yesterday. If you guys didn't catch Skiz's stream, it was actually pretty funny. I love Skiz. He's so funny sometimes. If you watch this stream, you know exactly where I'm going with this. So Ren logs on the server. And Ren's, Ren's like, sorry for the noise. You know, it'll just be like 10 minutes or so. And then I'll be done. <laughs> sometimes. <laughs> and uh, he's he's grinding with her. He's grinding with her, with her uh, uh, nether stars. Right? He's killing wither boss after wither boss after wither boss and it's doing the noise every time he spawns one. And Skiz is, is Skiz making comments, you know, geez, how many, how many wither skulls did he have to, to, to get, you know, this many? <laughs> and not, not five minutes later, Skiz goes, I need a beacon. I wonder if anybody on the server is selling beacons. <laughs> And I go, Skiz, listen, do you hear that noise? <laughs> do you think Ren needs that many beacons for himself? <laughs> like, <laughs> it was great. It was great. Oh, uh, here I am just throwing my best friend under the bus. No, it was, it was a funny moment. Skiz was laughing about it. If, if he wasn't laughing about it, if he was actually embarrassed, I, I wouldn't be telling, retelling that story. But it was great. It was classic Skiz. <laughs> Uh, oh, and then there was the half price thing too. That was that was pretty com comical too. So, here's the other part of the story for those of you that didn't catch Skiz's stream. Here's why you guys need to. Here's why you guys need to tune into Skiz's stream because it's it's just it's comedy hour for sure. So Ren's doing the killing wither after wither, and we're we're listening to this gong gong over and over again. And B Dub says Ren. You sh we should get all the people that are on the server right now having to listen to this. We should all get a discount. We should all get 50% off on your beacons. And Ren's like, you be quiet, B-dubs. Well, for some reason, Skiz just thought that was the case. And he went and bought beacons and paid half price. Because, <laughs> you know, B-dubs made it so. <laughs> so, both me and the chat had to tell him. Skiz, 
they're not actually half price. It was just a suggestion from V Dubs that obviously Ren wasn't on board with. <laughs> it was great. It was so good. I was laughing. I was laughing. All right, let's see. Let's fortune these up. What was there? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten of them. I don't know how many quartz they actually bought with these ten ore, um, but let's find out what we get. In fact, uh, ooh, I almost want to. Here, let's toss these down so we don't get them mixed up. And let's see. It's gonna make people nervous. I just let them sit there. Okay, so we got more than double out of the ore. Could have been better, but 22, I'll take it. And with our powers combined... What's this? Math? 121? Math? I did it right. I did it right! Oh, okay. I, it's, it's, today's been a rough day, so... <laughs> just want to make sure. <laughs> I wanted to make sure. <laughs> All right, sweet. So we got 121 diamonds to add to our ledger. Thanks for backing me up on that chat. Sometimes I can't mathificate. It's tough. Streamer brain and and recording brain. I'm streaming and recording at the same time. I'm trying to do both. And oh, we're gonna. I'm gonna need your brains again. All right, I think this is my ledger. I can't name it obviously because we gotta update it. Okay, so so far we've made 180 diamonds from quartz, and we need to add 121 to that, which brings our total to 301. All right. Hey, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. And, uh, yeah, I did need those diamonds. I was, once again, completely broke. So now the question is, with that many diamonds, over 300 made... I think there's a 250 trophy that we could upgrade our trophy already. Let's go see. I better bring the diamonds with me. I don't know if he's got an ender chest. Let's just, let's just bring a stack. It was he charged for me. It's a diamond block, isn't it? It's a diamond block, from what I remember. Okay. Okay, we'll bring our diamond block with us. Make another trip across the server. Hopefully this time we don't run into any shulkers and invisible hypnos. <laughs> oh, we can do it via mail. How does that work? He mentioned he was going to do that. I have no idea how it works. He's not online. Wait, are you saying I can't just go get the trophy myself? He's, he took it off. He, he completely... Okay, nope. We got it as... Okay, so you guys know this because you watch Azuma's videos. I don't know this, and I can't assume that all my viewers know it either, if it's going in the video. So we're going to go all the way... We're going to go all the way there to find out that we have to mail it, Okay. We gotta let this be more be natural. <laughs> so that they get the message as well. But if I if I cut right after I say I'm gonna go to his shop and get the trophy, there might be a couple viewers in the YouTube comments fast enough to tell me that's not gonna work. And I just comment farmed. Brilliant. Do it! Just do it! Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's going to give me at least five extra comments for engagement. YouTube's going to push that video so hard. It might be a one out of ten for me. We'll see. I'll give you an update next week. <laughs> if the strat worked. <laughs> this video is going to be... On every single one of your home pages, guaranteed. <laughs> Wait, where is Azuma's shop? I forget. What are we looking for? Oh, it's far, isn't it? He's like way back here. <laughs> oh, we don't have to cross a river to get to it, do we? Okay, there's a thing. <laughs> <laughs> 
Mm -mm -mm. Already on the uh, already on your homepage because you watch my videos. That that's good. Thank you. Okay, this is the one downfall of. I don't even know where we are right now. Come on, Tyler, you can do it. Uh huh. Okay. Okay, we made it to the sales office. Luckily, we have horse parking right here. Okay, that didn't eject me the way I wanted it to. All right, there's our trophies. Oh, 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 this is just the scoring system. Right. Oh, man, I'm actually behind. Uh, okay, so this is a good reason to upgrade to the 250. At least that catches us up with uh, XB, Ren, and Azuma himself. Looks like Cleo. I knew it. I knew it. Of course, Cleo is just killing it with the book sales. Okay, so last time we just came in here. And we read this book. And there's only the 100 diamond trophies. I want the 250. Where's that at? Oh, right. There was this page of the book. I can only purchase the 100 trophy here. Uh, the other amounts, 250, can be in the mail system. Right, we got to use the mail system. So how do I tell them which one we went? Send your one diamond block to the sales shop. And you'll receive the next trophy level. Okay, so he just knows that we're at two, we're at 100, so he'll up us by one. Okay. Sales shop. I wonder if I have any. Ooh. I haven't gotten in here to actually see what these look like. Are these, oh, at the end of the season, are we given like uh, an award for who's got the most? These are cool. I don't remember looking at those last time. Okay. What a great actor. It's like I didn't know that. It's like I didn't get that information from you guys already. Spoilers. You spoilers. <laughs> Fantastic. Because I'm pretty sure I skimmed over that part if it was there last time. Parkour. So it makes sense that I didn't remember. And I just made that ride for nothing. <laughs> Next Oscar winner. Thank you, thank you, thank you, guys. Move over, Tom Cruise. <laughs> who's even Who's even winning Oscars these days? Who won the uh, Who watched the Oscars? Leading in a lead role. Who is the leading actor? Winners this year. Cillian. Cillian Murphy. I feel terrible. I don't know who that is. Oh, from Oppenheimer? I didn't see Oppenheimer. Killian. Killian. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I have no idea who that is. An actor from Oppenheimer? No. Peaky Blinder? What? Not Emma Watson. Emma Stone. Yeah, I remember her winning, actually. Um, and then I watched that movie that she won for. That was an experience. <laughs> Poor Things, I think it's called. Huh. Oh, the dude that was Scarecrow. Okay. Yes. Okay, so his role was in Oppenheimer, right? Yeah, Poor Things was uh, a ride. <laughs> it was also one of those where I'm like, it gets over and I'm like, I think I liked it. <laughs> it's not for kids. Definitely not for kids. My wife did make, yeah, it was my wife's idea, for sure. <laughs> Poor things is barely for adults. <laughs> uh, Kia Cat, thank you so much for the 100 bits. My computer, my computer fans being a doofus and deciding to act up and overheat. I'm gonna take pity on it and head out. Um, have a great stream, everybody. Stay awesome, MP. 
Oh, Kitty Cat, I hope, uh, hope your computer doesn't overheat. Uh, maybe maybe check, make sure you're not wearing, uh, playing back rooms. If you launch back rooms, the, the game back rooms. Even if it's minimized, it'll, it'll burn your PC up. <laughs> Trust me. <laughs> uh, Miranda Miller, thank you for the 100 bits. Impulse, if you want to name your business ledger, use an anvil. Works without signing the book. Ah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Good idea, good idea. And pop. Killian is an Irish national treasure. Did I say it right this time? It was with a C, so I wanted to just say Cillian, but... Ooh, food poisoning's the worst. Jesslyn Marie, how you doing? Thank you so much for the 100 bits. Iron trap doors on lights instead of the pressure plates. So it rises like a sidewalk would. Yeah, that could be a thing. Um, had a couple other ideas too. It sounded like B-Dubs was working on an idea as well. So I think Kim and I should get together. And uh, I, I, think, I think it would make sense for there to be different styles, right, throughout the city. So like maybe this street, maybe this street is uncovered because this is the market street and we want it to be like bright and vibrant. And then maybe over in the slums, they have more like slummy, <laughs> slummy ones. I don't know what that'd be. And then somewhere in the middle iron. I don't know. Yeah, we can mix and match, I suppose. It doesn't have to be the same throughout the city. All right. So let's see. How do we, how do we mail it to him? Is it just a Zuma stamp then? I don't think I have any that are specifically for the sales office. Is there a special stamp or did he just designate his mailbox to be the trophy shop? Just send it to X. Okay. All right, we'll just send it to X. I feel like I should write something. <laughs> oh no. <sighs> Only one problem. I can't afford it. I guess we'll find out if this has any XP in it. Ooh, oh no. Good job. Oh, I used the books. Just right in the book. That's what those are for? That's what all these books are for? Okay. Everybody's been writing on paper. I figured that if it was a short message that it that would be it'd be okay to do that, but alright. All right, we'll just use the booking quill. That'll work. Uh, sales trophy? I don't know what he calls them. I'll see that there's a diamond block there. I guess I need to say who it's from. I feel like I shouldn't sign it. Then he can reuse the book, right? People aren't signing these, are they? Feels wasteful. Then you got this random book. You have to name it and stuff. Please and thank you. <laughs> Please and thank you with a, not a capital. Perfect. Some are signing it. That's all right. I'm, I know his Zuma, he's big on recycling. So we'll, we'll let him recycle this book. We won't sign it. And look at, I mean, finally get to use one of these. Finally get to use one of these. All right. And Ethos around to make sure the mail system's going to work perfect. All right, diamond block, our note. Stamp in here, go into Azuma. Pop that there. 
And off it goes. It's definitely going to make it. <laughs> Etho frantically goes to Nether to make sure. System's been working flawlessly, right, Etho? Etho, it's been working flawlessly. It's good. Crazy system. Trust the mailbox. We do. We trust it. <laughs> it's not usually... Well, what happens? Um, something happened when I sent something to Corrales. He never got it. That was a long time ago. I'm sure you've worked out any kind of bugs that you've got since then. That was a long time ago. That was like a month ago. Maybe not that long. It was before Corrales sent me parts of my horse. <laughs> it was before that, and that was weeks ago, so maybe it was. Man, I'm just flying. Okay. All right, we will wait for a response from Azuma. In the meantime, let's get some villagers bred up. Uh, I think I want to get some masons and... Uh, maybe some other ones, like a armor or something. Uh, we can probably trade iron. The other night, Tango, me, and Skiz fixed the iron farm. We had a couple cells that were short a couple villagers. We're not sure what happened to them. Probably suffocated in the wall is what we assume. But, uh, yeah, we got that fixed, and hopefully we'll have enough iron. Then I can just trade, get emeralds from that. And then we can use those emeralds to buy from the masons and get ourselves some easy quartz. I should have fortuned that. Had I not been doing my little monologue there, I would have remembered. Oh, well. There was no cactus cooking in that one. Yeah, no, it needs balanced. Um, the there's two, there's two XP banks, right? And this one is basically stealing all the cactus and not leaving a lot for this one. You can see the light turned on, so it did manage to get there in the end. But however, I mean, okay, let's take it now. All right, we see one coming through now. Oh, and the Bob song starts, of course. And, oh, 33 levels, nice. Oh yeah, reset the light. I, maybe, maybe I use my own system. So we just go. Oh, I do want to see something real quick. I missed it. Ah, I missed it. I'm gonna hit it again. You can bop 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 Wait. My guy, you can bop if you want to. Every time you hit this, it should send the card off. Uh oh. You can bop if you want to. Behind. Oh wait, never mind. Never mind. It has to turn the light off to do it. So we just go. Yeah, it has to turn the light off to do it. We'll go check the cart instead. You guys gotta be getting sick of the Bob song today. You gotta be getting sick of the Bob song. Yeah, I mean, there, it's a great song, but there is too much as uh, there is such thing as too much Bob. <laughs> oh, good, perfect. <laughs> Never. Oh, jeez. Okay. Um, yeah, so the reason why I checked the cart is basically it's hard to explain. It's 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 kind of hard to explain, but here's the idea, right? Um, the light will turn on when the first full mine cart with a chest in it happens. So it fills up with 27 stacks of cactus green. And then uh, it senses that the cart's full. I should explain the system to you guys. It's going to happen in the video. You guys want an explanation anyway? You want me to explain how this works? I, I just realized. I, I mean, it is, it's going to be in the video, but I can, I can explain. Okay. I'll have to free cam this because it's so tight. Okay, basically the way it works is we've got, we've got a... 
barrel here that's got full, all full except for one item, which means this cart won't get ejected until it's completely full. So that means it's completely filled up with 27 stacks of cactus green, right? Now, we don't want to save the cactus green. We're just uh, we're just using it to build XP. There'd be way too much cactus green. The entire server doesn't need that much cactus green. Um, so when this fills up, we have to do two things. We have to empty it so that we can continue building up more, more XP. We don't want to shut the system down. We want to allow this thing to continue to build XP. So if we forget about this thing... Uh, not cactus cream, cactus green. Uh, it's just called green now. It's just green dye. Anyway, um, they, they did change the name of it, didn't it? It used to be cactus green. Now it's just green dye. Anyway, uh, you get what I mean. So we want to get rid of what's, what's filled up this cart and then bring it back so that it can continue. And we want to just have it continue, 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 continue. Um, because otherwise why cap, why cap it and just like let the rest just die. Um, because if we forget about this for a while, it'd be cool to come up here and get 100 levels or something crazy, right? So we send the card off. Uh, it does this crazy thing where it drops down and it gets aligned to what's basically like a half, a vertical half slab kind of block. You see the, uh, the hitbox here? So it gets aligned. So it's halfway in between this mud block and this like slab. And then what happens is because the mud block is not a full block, this cart will actually snap down onto that rail there, but it's still in between these two blocks. So half the cart ends up inside this cauldron and inside this cauldron has lava. So it breaks the mine cart, which now stays a chest mine cart. It doesn't break it into two parts like it used to. So it stays a chest mine cart, gets sucked up into this hopper. Meanwhile, all the contents that are in it get spit out and get deleted by this cactus. So you get to keep the mine cart with the chest in it. All the items get deleted and then it cycles itself back through the system. So I did this part here where basically once the mine cart comes in, it sees that and then kicks it back up. And then goes up this way, goes up a, a water elevator that has waterlogged scaffolding. So the minecart goes through the scaffolding and on top of that is a rail. And so basically it can just cycle itself through. And, it, and then and now it's empty and it just sits there. So that's what just happened when I turned that light off. It cycled this through and now it's empty again and collecting again. At the same time that it did that, it kicked this cauldron. See... <laughs> As this activated, it, it sent a signal up to this cauldron and it pushed this cauldron filled with water up. That's actually getting a uh, comparator signal off of here, right? So it pushes this up and now the system knows that it's got at least 30 levels because the cauldron's been pushed up, right? And it could keep building and building and building and building. And yeah, so that's where the light is on the other side of this note block. Okay. The only time that cauldron's going to get pushed back down is when you hit this note block and it signals this piston to push it back down. And that's the, that's basically saying, hey, I just pulled all the levels out of the system and uh, now I need to wait for it to build. But <laughs> let's say this is where things got super complicated. This was so much fun. I designed this yesterday morning. I haven't done this kind of redstone in a while, so I, I really enjoyed myself. Anyway, um, let's say someone came up after this cart not only built up a full 27 stacks, but then built up another like 26 stacks. No, 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 no. Let's go further than that. Yeah, no, no, no. Let's go further. Yeah, let's go there. Okay. Let's say this cart built up 27 stacks. It recycled itself, and then it built up another 26 stacks, right? And then somebody pulls the XP. So they just pulled uh, whatever number that was. 50-something. 50 53? 50 whatever. Uh, they just pulled 53 stacks worth, worth, worth of XP. The next time this cart got another stack, it would be full again, and then it would turn the light on. But then it, the light would be on with only one stack of XP, 
and it wouldn't be close to 30 levels. And so somebody would see the light on and they would feel like they got robbed, right? So then what I had to do was say, okay, when somebody tells me that they hold the XP by punching this note block, I also need to do one more time of sending the card off so that it's empty again, so that it can start from scratch to build those 27 stacks worth of, of smelted product. <laughs> I'm sorry, you guys gloss it over. <laughs> So it does all that. That's why this is as complicated as it is. That's why this is as complicated as it is. And then when I was done with that, I had to do a, a do two of them. So it's just mirrored. So when Skiz says, hey, I want an XP bank where the light turns on when it's got 30 levels or more, and I want it to continue to build. That was the other requirement. I want it to continue to build XP instead of just like stopping at 30 and wasting the rest. It got wild. It got wild. <laughs> but I got to tell you, I mean, I had I had fun designing that, you know. It's like I said, it's been a while since I've had unique redstone challenges because like everything has been done. All the farms have been been made and mastered and uh you know, totally most efficient methods are, are are figured out by now. So the only thing left to do is really just to make them like goofy, you know, for, for fun, you know, make them visually stimulating, things like that. By the way, if you guys didn't see Ethos episode yesterday, you should, because he's got one of the most visually stimulating farms I've ever seen. Um, yeah, so that that's all that's really left in in this kind of redstone or world is to like come up with your own thing that's like unique and creative like that. That's gonna definitely be not as efficient. But then when you have problems to tackle like this or like Tango's, you know, decked out that had like super unique challenges that he had to figure out, you get a chance to like actually have fun designing your own redstone circuits and stuff. It's cool. It's cool. I was really happy that I got a chance to. To do that even though it did take me i was pounding my head against the you think this morning was bad trying to figure out what was going on with that 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 disc player yesterday morning about four hours in i was like i kept finding bug after bug after bug or, or something i hadn't thought of you know and you have to go through all the scenarios you have to you have to basically um use case you know oh what if somebody Holds XP when it's double collected. You know what I mean? Like you have to go through all that kind of stuff. And I probably still, I probably still missed, missed something. We'll find out. Unit testing. Exactly, exactly. The level of quality and dedication uh, this week's video had, had, this week's video had is inspiring and exciting. Thank you so much, uh, Kimmy. I gotta, I gotta look over here so it's bigger. Kimmy Delini, thank you so much for that. I appreciate that. I really did, um, kind of, I did kind of pour my heart and soul into that episode. So thank you for for noticing. Thank you for letting me know that you noticed. <laughs> I appreciate that. It was, I think it was one of those things where, you know, I, I am a, I'm a learner. What was it? The um, uh, Marcus Buckingham did the book, and you can figure out what traits you have as a human being. What is it called? Mine's my top one was learner. I'm a learner, and so that's why I continue to push myself to do things in Minecraft that I've never done before because I want to learn. I want to learn new stuff. I want to learn how to build cyberpunk style. And I'm not, I'm not one to like think I can just figure it out on my own, you know. So I was able to reach out and and uh, get some people who are are they know what they're doing, let's say, to teach me. B Dubs or Durple, AD Craft, some greats out there that, that that know what they're doing in the building world, especially cyberpunk style. Spent some time with them, put in the work, you know. Put in the work to learn, get better, improve. I enjoy it. What is the Marcus Buckingham Strengths Finder? Thank you, thank you, Andy Dirk. That's what I was looking for. Yeah, it's called Strengths Finder. 
It identifies your, like, top five strengths. There's like a test you take. Anyone guess what my number two was? Learning was one. Take a guess what my number two was. I might have told you guys before. Hard work, I don't think that's one of them. <laughs> not teaching, not creating, not competitiveness. Empathy, you're close. Communication, no, it wasn't communication. Harmony, you got it, in dev. Is that because, is that because you've been in so many streams that I've said it before? My number two strength was harmony. And basically that's just my desire to um, make sure everybody feels good, you know? Um, I'm, I hate conflict with a passion. I avoid conflict uh, to a fault. Um, yeah, and I just want everybody to be happy, you know? So that, that's my number two. I want everybody to get along. <laughs> so knowing those things, you can start to kind of put two and two together. Why, like, some of my behavior that you guys see on streams and stuff even uh, is the way it is, you know? Cool. So, uh, sometimes, sometimes when you're doing like a Friday night stream, Hermitcraft after dark and stuff, uh, your brain's not working at 100% and you might make mistakes from time to time, such as leaving the door wide open for zombies to come in and, and, uh, take a bite out of my villagers. <laughs> All right, let's turn this down. All right, all right. Well, we could cure them. Hi, Kelf. We could cure them and get even better rates. That's not a bad idea. Golden apple weakness potions. What do we need? We actually, let's see. Okay, we do. We still have some decent ones back here. I'll just, uh, we'll use these guys today. Give me something else to do. Excuse me, I'm just going to borrow that. Okay, never mind. What about you? Still too too close? Okay. Beat Dubs is on it. It's cool. Alright, three beds. I'm gonna break these real quick. Let's get these guys breeding. Just break them, just in case somebody else had claimed it while that, that door was open. Usually you see the little sparkles as they claim their bed. I didn't see that happen, but I might have missed it. Alright, let's give one stack for now. See what happens. <laughs> I know, it's so weird now with the villagers, they're giving you the side eye when they're, they're breeding and stuff. Gets awkward. Artate, thanks for the 200 bits. M's boo. M's bow, maybe. Thank you so much for the five gifted sub bomb. Appreciate ya. Revenant, thanks for the 100 bits. Streaming mistake or permanent sale? You decide. Calculated. Calculated mistake. No. Calculated, calculated. Yeah, I meant to do that. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Huh? Wait. I need to see the particles. No, no, they're done. They're done. They're done. Yeah, hey little dude. <laughs> hey little dude. Oh great, they're gonna throw him the carrots. I might just spam some beds in here. We need a few. Uh, and I think I want to cover this up. I need like a door lock system so these guys don't try to get out. I could... Could I do... I had a door before. <laughs> I don't know how to do it. What if I did the... Oh, no. No, no, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you. Now, he can't get in there, right? But I can? Aha. Uh -huh. Smart. Uh oh. 
I gotta do it on this side too. No, I'll just do this. Okay. That's how we do it. That's how we do it. <laughs> Let's go get a bunch of beds. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, he looks like his mom. He has his mom's eyes. <laughs> uh. Let's see. How many do you think I should get? How many villagers should I make? I feel so powerful saying that. How many villagers should I make? Like, two that trade iron and... I can't go crazy, guys. This is a shared area. I can't do 30. Come on. How many masons? Okay, so let's start. Let's start with this. How many? How many like armors? Who else? What armors? Weaponsmith, and uh, what's the other thing that does iron? There's three villagers that will toolsmith. Oh yeah. So those three will, will will pay me for iron, right? Which I should have an abundance of from the iron farm that Tango and I did, assuming it's working again. Okay. So I can get two or three of those guys. Maybe one of each might be good. And then five masons, you're suggesting? Toxic Joe? That sound good? See Bob the Cat. Says you're getting so good at building. Thank you so much. I've been learning. I've been learning from the best. It's been fun. About five masons or so. Yeah. Okay. So we need what is that? Eight. Eight villagers. There was two in there already. Those are already claimed uh, professions. So we need to have ten total, which means we need ten beds. There's three beds in there already. So we need seven more beds, and I have one. So we need to make six more beds. Ouch. That hurt my brain. And I hope I got that right. <laughs> Did I get that right? One, two, three, four, five, six. There we go. And then there's three in there. So that's the ten. Minus the two that are going to stay. The other three can get their own professions. Perfect. Okay. Oh, yeah. My brain's pretty broken after that redstone debacle that earlier. I may or may not have been actually frustrated. <laughs> Thankfully, Tango came over and then it and then it made sense. <laughs> That's the other thing. Um, I'm not much of a. I can't learn. I can't learn things from like reading. I have to have visualization. And so when you guys are in chat and you're trying to tell me how to solve stuff, rarely will that ever work for me. Rarely. And that that and I get it. That's got to be super frustrating to be in chat, know the issue, and I can't. I just can't process what you're saying. My brain, yeah, I'm a visual learner. I need I need to. That's why Tango had to come by and literally like lay the blocks out in front of me and explain for me to understand what was going on. All right. Well, these guys are gonna. What do they take? Five minutes. I could just load them up, right? I could just load them up, go to launch, and come back, and they'll probably be good to go. I would hope. As long as they don't have failed attempts. I'm going to close that up so that we don't get a, a baby in there. A mega the babies! Imagine a little dude gets in that one block and then glows, grows up. Oh, nice. They're they're ready already. Okay, I know it's weird, but we got to watch. <laughs> I just want to make sure they don't get the uh, exclamation point thingies. Okay, there we go. Wow, you're fast. A gestation period. It's crazy. <laughs> Feed them too. <laughs> Tango said that in stream the other night. Can you, like, force feed the babies so they grow up faster like you can animals? I was like, whoa, it's a little weird, but okay. <laughs> no. 
Uh, Celine, thank you so much for the gifted sub. Danny Rose, thanks for 200 bits. So happy I've been able to watch an impulse stream on my birthday. The city's looking amazing. Thanks for being a fun place to chill and lurk. Well, Danny Rose, hope you have a good birthday. We, it's been a little bit since we've done one. <laughs> hope you have a good one. Hope you have a good one. I wish I wish we could show you the video of that Skiz's niece. I wish we could show you the video because her facial, like we we, tr Skiz does a better job pulling his face than I do, but um, her facial expression during that delivery was amazing, <laughs> amazing. <laughs> Yeah, they can't see the zombies. They're not going to get scared, right? Even here. Maybe, maybe through the chest. Uh, we got a couple minutes. Weakness potion? Let's go get golden apples. Weakness. How do you make weakness potions? It's just awkward. And fermented spider eye or something like that. What is it? I forget. Help me. Help me, chat. Can't brainificate. Brain not working. Didn't get enough sleep last night. What will happen with the video? Oh, it's just it's 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 his daughter, it's his niece, you know, and then it's I don't think uh, the family's cool with with uh, her her face and her identity being public and stuff like that. That's more it's a matter of privacy. That's why the video is not getting shown. Spruce button. Water bottle for Benson Spider. I don't even need awkward. Okay, sweet. I will need to make some water bottles. Oh, oh, oh. We gotta make a splash though. Right, we do have to make a splash. Fermented spider eye is a combination of our favorite mushrooms. Wait, why do I only have. Uh oh. Oh. I know what's going on. I think we left them, right? B dubs and I were, we were <laughs> mushroom farming. There they are. Okay. This isn't it. Sugar. Sugar? Right. I forgot that ingredient. Do, do, do. Oh, and then the apples, of course. We're gonna get some. Oh, I have two. That's all I need. Let's do it. I might be a little late to lunch. My wife will totally forgive me. She'll totally forgive me. Said, uh, so usually on Wednesday nights, we go to the grocery store. We go to the grocery store twice a week now so that we don't buy so much every time. And I hate it. I hate going to the grocery store because inevitably there's always somebody in my way just camping in the middle of the aisle, unaware that they're blocking everyone. I tried talking my wife into doing like the the pickup, you know, pick at it, picking it up. Oh, I gotta make these, or or you know, even getting them delivered if 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 uh, we wanted to splurge because it costs extra, you know. But she is real picky about everything like that that we buy. I mean, it's not not a picky person. Don't get me wrong. I mean, she she wants to pick out her produce. She's not going to trust anybody to just grab whatever. She wants to pick the produce. She wants to make sure. She wants to look at the shelves and see if this can of soup is, is a better deal than that can of soup. And you, didn't, you can't get that when you order online and stuff, right? I mean, you could look through the, the ads and stuff maybe, but it's harder. Definitely harder. Anyway, so... <laughs> man, I'm just going off today. So we, we go... Okay, this is going to be tough. I go, Ow! Just trying to use your stand! Back off. <laughs> so we go twice a week now. And, and because we go twice a week, the trips are at least shorter. So I told her today, I said, you know, we don't have to wait till 5 p.m. to go. Because usually I, I I work until 5 p.m. And then we go. And we come home and make dinner. We usually skip the gym on Wednesday nights because of the grocery shop shopping. I said, you know what? Today we, we can go whenever you want. And she's like, you don't have to work? 
I was like, yeah, but I do. But I'm my own boss. I, so who's to say that I don't just work till six today to make up for the hour I took off in the middle of the day? <laughs> she kind of smirked at me because I, mean, I think she she heard it in my voice when I was like, I was like, no, because I, I went on and I said, can't nobody tell me what to do. <laughs> yeah, I went that far. I said, can't nobody tell me what to do. <laughs> so we go whenever you want. <laughs> it felt good. It did feel a little braggadocious. But it, it did feel good to say. Because a lot of times I forget that, you know. I still stick to my 9 to 5 or 8 to 5 schedule that... I had, you know, when I was working in the corporate world. Oh, I just want to throw this at you. Is that cool? All right. And you and you. Heal up. Be cheaper, please. What's going on in there? Three babies. Oh, he come over, say hi. And now he jealous. That one jealous. Yeah, go back to jumping on the bed. <laughs> They do look cold. They do look cold. <laughs> uh, have I played the most recent Phasmo event? Not yet. Not yet. Oh, we're hoping to. I just realized I can't say any more about that. You'll see. <laughs> You'll see. Agent, thank you so much. Says, I just wanted to say a big thank you. We are currently getting ready for my dad's funeral tomorrow. He passed a week after my son's first birthday. Hermitcraft has been... Uh, a good distraction. Uh, sorry, it scrolled off right then. Um, wow, thank you. Um, I'm sorry about that. Uh, I'm glad we could we could be here to help. Get your mind off that. So sorry for your loss. Yeah, our condolences. Sorry to hear that. That's got to be tough. But yeah, yeah, we like we like having the uh, streams and videos and stuff. Hopefully, distract from the heaviness. That, that might be happening, and, and I'm sure everybody's going through something, right? Maybe not that heavy, but um, it's nice. It's nice to have a, a retreat. That's that's what I that's what I use, you know, entertainment content for, YouTube and, and whatnot. Especially during the pandemic, man. We're gonna wait. These guys, shut up. Hey, finally some levels. Oh, no, no I have some. <laughs> Obviously, don't use this as much anymore, do I? Thank you guys for all the hearts and chat. Uh, it's nice seeing it's nice seeing chat come together, support each other. You guys are awesome. I never I never feel like I have the right words in, in situations like that to, um, to really help, you know? So having you guys also have their, their backs as well is, is awesome. Super awesome. You guys are great. Sam with the 100 bits says, how long is too long to listen to the same song on repeat? Like 13 hours is too long? Yeah, probably. I think I would go a little crazy listening to the same song for 13 hours straight. Why, you guys want to hear Bop again? No, 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 no. <laughs> we heard Bop enough today. We, <laughs> I might not play Bop for a week after this. I love this song. Ellie Beatmaker did an amazing job, obviously. But, um, we got enough of it, especially since, oh man, it's going to trigger something now. Every time I hear it, it's going to make me remember the struggle we had for the first hour and a half of stream today. Mute it for you, and uh, or mute it for me, and play it for you. Uh, you guys can do that on your own. You can just open up YouTube. In fact, Ellie, Ellie would probably appreciate. I'll mute, I'll mute the music. If you guys want to open up another tab and, and go, hey yo, there's our first zombie healed. Wait a minute, this is bad. He's just gonna kill that guy right back. Don't kill him right back. I have zero separation between the two. You, you. Leave that one alone. <laughs> so far, so good. I think he's on me. So we're safe. It's a good thing I was here. Otherwise, there would be problems. 
<laughs> oh man, yeah, I better stay. He's looking at this guy's looking at me like, look at him, look at him. I don't like this. <laughs> yes. Oh, I love these. <laughs> he knows he's funny. He knows he's funny. Oh, this is the best. You couldn't script this. Oh, wow. <laughs> I don't know if I like this guy. <laughs> hey, hey, buddy. You think I could uh, maybe let me out of here a little bit? A little, a little dangerous in here. It's a little crowded. Not really loving the situation, especially this guy. Oh, actually, never mind. He's cool. Oh, you guys are great. You guys are great. Oh, wow, they really did. That's not that much better of a deal. What were we buying from these guys, actually? Yeah, no, the gold. The gold. Okay, this is another good way to get emeralds. I forgot about that, because we have plenty of gold, obviously. So I can trade one gold for an emerald. Okay, that's beautiful. Beautiful. And hopefully they stay that way, yeah? You guys are the best. You just made you you just made this stream turn around. Like as rough of a start we had today, we needed that laugh, did we not? We needed that laugh, guys. That was a win. That was a W right there. <laughs> oh, I was using them to buy redstone. That's true. But now that we've got the gold farm and we have an, an abundance of gold, let me just bring this in there. Um. Yeah, we can, we can, we'll be, we'll be killing it. Yeah, those guys are the stream MVP, for sure. What was it? I was supposed to name it, um, Kelf, and then, oh, I gotta plug that hole, I do that every time. Uh, Kelf, and then what, we were gonna name the other one, I forgot what we were gonna name them. Yeah, we were selling them Rotten Flesh, but nobody's using this farm anymore. This farm's stupid. Got better farms than you now. Okay, that, this farm didn't deserve that, we worked hard on it. <laughs> What was the other name? Parm. Kelf Parm. Yeah, and I was going to switch them around. Right. I don't have a name tag. All right. I'm going to ask that same question in a, in a week. Remind me. <laughs> uh, good way to get emeralds. Great way to get emeralds. And XP. Beautiful. Because I am super low on emeralds. From my typos. Are they gonna reset? They're not gonna reset. Alright. Well, I think, yeah. Stuff's happening in there. Stuff's happening. We've got a full blown daycare. Full blown daycare going on in there. Very nice. I think I need to, um. Is it actually safe in here? Here we go. Perfect. Perfect doorway. I'm gonna AFK here while I have lunch and go to the grocery store. And when I come back, every every villager should be all breeded up and grown up and I can I can continue on with my episode. That'll be perfect. Alright, my wife is sending me text messages. I wonder if that's because she wants me to she wants me to wrap up my stream and come 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 go to the grocery store. She'll probably do that. Alright, I'm gonna put most everything away. Just in case. I I AFKing is always scary for me. If I lose my fortune pick, I can live with myself. It wouldn't be the end of the world. What was that? Oh no! Uh, I guess I saw the zombies! Ha! <laughs> well, hey! It wasn't in the stream title, but uh, look at us! We made an iron farm. <laughs> He'll be fine. He, he's good. He's fine. This is this is fine. <laughs> all right, guys. Let's uh, let's let's raid somebody. Thanks for hanging out. You guys have been amazing. Thank you so much for all your support, even through all my frustration today. Jess Marie, thanks for the hundred bits. Says I watched the video on uh, using VR in real life in the real life series. I wanted to see the reactions using that in Phasmo. Oh, uh, yeah, it'll be just as clunky, I'm sure. <laughs> it'll be just as clunky. 
And Sam, I will check out your links when I get back. Thank you for sending those. Alrighty. Who's streaming? Who's streaming today? Tango streaming? Just started? Okay. Okay. We raid Tango. Right on. I will start the raid. Go join Tango, guys. Hopefully uh, he has better luck with whatever redstone he's doing today. Of course he will, because he was the smart one that told me what was wrong with mine. <laughs> oh, Andrew, thanks for the 100 bits. Have a good one, everybody. See you guys uh, Saturday. We'll see you Saturday. Have a good rest of your week.